And up. And up. And up. It is the official King Pain. This is the official King Pain show. <laughs> The home of the lituation, the littest place on earth. Gathering close. Gathering close. We, in, we got a lot of things to get into. We got a lot of things to get into. Like this video, like this video, like this video. We in, act like you know where you're at. This is the home of the lituation where it is always lit, lit. Okay, and this morning, when I tell you it's going to be lit, okay, on period, I mean, what did you expect? <laughs> Welcome to Messy Mornings with the official King Pay. Yes, it did. The one and only. <laughs> yes. Often imitated, never duplicated, a dusty bitch could still always never dingle buried. I'm talking about you. <laughs> Oh, oh! I like making these bitches move. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Y'all gonna have to forgive me for the scheduling of my lives. Okay, oh, period. I'll be over here on my CCTV gagging. Okay. <laughs> oh, because when I speak, bitches move. When I speak, bitches move. I don't even be impressed. Not at all. Not at all when, okay, oh, period. Okay, oh, period. Yes, the best way to know when I'm live is to get in that Discord when, okay, on period. Because I always let my people know right before the show. Okay, on period, I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay. Yay, sir. Yay, sir. You know, the Fish King Pain is a one man team. Okay, on period. And I be busy. Plus, you know, I have my routine. Before the show, you know, I still get nervous. Y'all make me nervous. Every time, every time to this day, I still get butterflies before I click live. Yikes. I'll be over here praying and stuff. Like, Lord, help me, please. Help me, help me, please. Yes, it did. He always come through, though. He always come through. I mean, if God be for me, who can be against me? <laughs> Dingleberry! You messed up, girl. You messed up, girl. Oh, the Bible says, touch not the head of my anointed. <laughs> you came for me, Larry. Mm -hmm. And I had to swallow you up when. <laughs> Get your mind out the gutter. I'm not talking about it like that. I'm not talking about it like that, weird. Okay, I'm here. Say that nasty shit for your hair of a man. Okay. For them little boys, you be over there touching when, okay, on period. Yes, it is. Start some shit, you get found up in the water. Crown family gathering close. Like this video, like this video, like this video right now. <laughs> Y'all have to push this nasty ass off in the puddle. Okay, on period. Don't fuck with the kid with. Don't fuck with the key queer. You was over there talking all that shit. You was over there popping all that motherfucking shit with. Little old kid. I'm not worried about the key. Key ain't nobody with. And the oop. And the oop. I am a child of the most high. Okay, on period. Girl. God always used the least likely. Okay, on period. That's how you know he did it. <laughs> the one you never expect, okay? And all the CCs, okay? With big platforms and big following, you never expect it would be the official key pay to really sock it to him. <laughs> oh, he's upset about it. He's upset about it with, okay, oh, period, girl. I done got him to admit that he gay. I mean, we already knew, okay, on period. But at least now you all have that confirmation win, okay, on period. Girls 2024, it's time to tear these hoes up out of the closet. Like, Brank show ass here, little boy. What you been over here doing in this closet? Okay. 
What you been over here doing in this closet? Okay, on period. Levon trading bought us back these motherfucking skeletons, and we want to know what that were. We want to know what that were. My, my, my. Motherfucking Larry going around making like the lawsuit between him and Levantre is closed. He won. Levantre was lying. Girl, come to find out the motherfucking lawsuit is still open, pending, and Larry just submitted a motion for a default judgment. Girl. Larry know a thing or two about a default judgment. <laughs> I mean, that's part of the whole reason that him and Tasha K fell out. Yeah. You don't know? Yeah, a lot of people ask me, like, what happened between Larry Reed and Tasha K? Because if you can recall, they used to be really good friends. Mm-hmm. Yes. Today, oh, the show is going to be intense, okay, on period. It's going to be layered. It's going to be explosive when, okay, on period. I hope that you guys are all ready for the show. I need everybody to be very, very quick to listen, okay, on period. I need everyone paying attention. Yes, it did, because this show is, again, layered, okay? We're going to take a walk down memory lane, okay, on period, to really uncover what that were, why that were, and what it is. Yes, it is. That's just what that were. <laughs> what that were. Yes. Who's ready to take a trip down memory lane? Yes. Back down memory lane. Yes. Who's ready to go down memory lane? Yes, it did. Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video. As I stated earlier, we have a lot of things to get into. Crown family gathering close. <laughs> Crown family don't play about the king. Crown family don't play about the king. What a crown family at? What a crown family at? What a crown family at? We got a high probability of a dusty hole strolling through on today when okay on period. Make sure that you guys are, are, are guarding the castle gates. Guard in the gates to the mansion eight. We in okay. I'm here. We don't need no dusty bitches coming through trying to wreck the life. Okay, I'm here. We got a lot of things to get into. We got a lot of things to get into. Like this video, like this video, like this video, all that and more. Directly after these are girl commercial breaks. Let's go. <laughs> I'm also saying I need to do something with my hair, otherwise I gotta get it all cut off. We booked an appointment at Style Kings at the barbershop. Let's go. Do you want fabulous hair? Are you looking for a product strong enough to tame your 4C hair? Hey, Ma! Hey, Ma, you don't have no more leave-in conditioner? Give me that. I know you did not use my Style King leave-in conditioner. Are you looking to knock the dust off them dreads? For a product that will rejuvenate and strengthen your hair, increase hair growth and shine, and smells great, well then you're in the right place. For the long, beautiful, healthy hair you deserve, choose Style King. Perfect on all hair types. Available online at theofficialkingpain.net. Get you some style today. Oh, and your mom calls that she needs some more conditioner. My bad. <laughs> I was just dusting, you know, making sure the place is nice and tidy for all of you. Yay. 
It's a wonderful day in the neighborhood. It's a wonderful day to be dusting. Would you be mine, Crown Family? Remember to subscribe to the show. Yes, yeah, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. You want to be subscribed, okay? And hit that <laughs> notification bell. That way you never miss a show. Yay. Yeah. Who's ready to get into some things? Ooh, and a lot of things we have to get into. And a lot of things we have to get into when we have another installment of Surviving Larry Reed. Hey, hey, hey Crown Family. I said, hey, Crown Family, let me see those crowns in the chat. Okay. William McRae exposes Conscious TV's rotten bussy win. My, my, my. Oh, Conscious TV oh, oh, has been responding, girl. <laughs> Girl, he motherfucker went live on IG crying when, okay, on period. It looks like the allegations are true. It must be some truth to it. I don't know. Okay, why else is the girl crying? Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Thoughts? Chat? Because I don't know. It's just my motherfucking opinion when, okay, on period. Looks like it might be some truth to the allegations that William McCray put out about Conscious TV, because why else is he crying? Let's talk about it. Conscious TV then comes forward on his YouTube channel um, to pretty much confirm that he's been in a sugar daddy, sugar baby relationship with Larry Reed, and he's done. He's done unless Larry is willing to fucking apologize. He got to correct this shit. He need to fix this shit, okay, on period. He wasn't willing to stand for oh, 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 Conscious TV. Conscious TV been out here windmilling, losing opportunities, friends, jeopardizing this platform for Larry. Looking like a fucking clown for Larry, and Larry will allow somebody to put out a narrative like that about him? Oh, Conscious is done. He said he had it, girl. Ooh. That pussy over there stinking right now, weird. Okay, old period. He over there, oh, 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 oh. stuck in his old musk. When talk about going back to school and shit, my my my, my my my, ooh, and then we're gonna get into the pending lawsuit. Okay, on period on the coffee directly after the show. Yes, it did. If you're not subscribed to the coffee, make sure that you subscribe to the coffee. When you don't want to miss it, you don't want to miss it. That's where we put all of our Larry Reed receipts. When in case you ever decide to. Follow through with that threat. Because, you know, that's part of the reason me and Larry are on opposite sides of the fence. Well, not that I would ever be on his side. Okay. But he called me. He threatened me. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Called me up on the phone, girl, and said, bitch, I will sue you. I will sue you. You better stop talking about me. I said, bitch. Well, get to sewing, bitch. Get to sewing. Here we get. So, since then, I've been compiling all my receipts. Yes, it did. Over there on the coffee. Yeah. That's where you find all of their read receipts. Yeah. Yeah. So if you're interested, all them CCs that cover Larry Twin, they're, they're, the receipts are there. Okay. Plus, we, we, we do our secret lives over there. We'll be live over there on the receipt book. Not the receipt book. Oh, I'm sorry. The coffee. Directly after the show. Hey, y'all. I say, hey, hey, crown family. Let me see those crowns in the chat. Let me see those crowns in the chat. We also have Tasha K sounding off on Comedy Hype when, okay, on period. Again, I tell you that Tasha K and Larry Reed used to be friends, okay? We're going to get into the fallout because I was there, okay? We're also going to take a, a trip down memory lane, okay? To establish, you know, a 
the history between Larry and Conscious, Daryl Moore, Tasha K, myself, William McCray, and others, to Larry. And to really just rub it in. Yeah, just smear all of CTV's makeup. <laughs> Could somebody bring me some tap water? Fuck, I throw it on that bitch. <laughs> ah, bitch. You stupid bitch. <laughs> Oh, you thought that that bussy was motherfucking platinum wheel. Okay, oh, period. Larry continues to deny you, bitch. Larry continues to deny you. As a matter of fact, he said that motherfucker oh, 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 William McCray shit was the best thing he didn't ever had with. Okay, oh, period. Is that what that was? I think that's what I heard. Girl, they was over there reminiscing with, okay? But they was over there singing. Reunited and it fell so good. What he said with reunited because you understood. He was over there praising William McCray. He said, You were you are the blueprint. You was out here doing it before all the girls with okay on period. You're that girl. He said, I don't even need CTV no more. That's what I heard. Did, did, did somebody hear something different? Let me know. Tell, that's what the fuck I heard, girl. Girl. He said, I don't even need CTV no more. They was over there planning picnics, winging, okay, on period. They was over there planning all, all rendezvous. Is that what you call it, CTV? Unconscious them, that's what they call it. They call it rendezvous. Okay, they was over there planning rendezvous when, yeah, yeah, William was over there talking about the next time he was going to Larry's. Okay, on period. And Larry was over there confirming the next time he was going to Williams. Okay, on period. Yeah, they were scheduling them bussy dates. <laughs> okay, on period. William is ready to drop that bussy on the floor for Larry. When okay, on period. My, my, my. Seems as though that he remembers that Pasapine win. Okay. But he forgot all of the hurt and turmoil that Larry's had caused them when. Okay, on period. Leave it to the official campaign to bring some clarity. Yes, it did. I got the receipts. I got the receipts. We and find out exactly what that were. What happened between William and Larry? Okay. Why Conscious TV is mad that they are reunited? <laughs> oh, what has caused Conscious TV to go live crying? That's that girl. No. no. Crying. Real tea. Oh, you. Okay. The girls always be making it up like I be. I don't got no reason. Friend, look, hold on. Because if you keep paying, I got no reason to lie. Look, hold on. Girl. <laughs> Sad. He's mad pressed. Look. <laughs> Girl, please. Girl, please. Like I said, there must be some truth to it. <laughs> y'all ready to have a good show i hope y'all ready to have a good show with okay oh period girl i promise i promise y'all gonna be gagging this whole show y'all promise y'all gonna be gagged this whole show what they said what they said praying for you with love and light babes we love you stay strong okay crying a mere allegations of hiv like, girl, what that were? What that were? What that were? And the look on Larry's face when motherfucker William McCray said that conscious had motherfucking the old package we in, girl. Like, he just seen, seen, seen a motherfucking ghost win, okay, on period. Yeah, that was all the confirmation that a bad bitch can need. That was all the confirmation we had, okay, OP right here. Bad bitches, get tested, be safe, wear protection with, okay, OP here, because these hoes out here is nasty, weird, and they be spreading motherfucking diseases. Stop spreading diseases around. Trying to get that fucking package to everybody. These hoes trying to get that motherfucking package to everybody. What your motherfucker crying for? You don't want people to know? 
See, 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 see. It's the girls like you that perpetuate the stigma. Okay, on period. Want everybody to accept the disease. Oh, it's not the the the, the death sentence that it that it used to be. But you're still embarrassed. You're still ashamed. You still don't want people to know. And when they find out, the only reaction, your only response is to go live crying. Stop spreading the package around. Stop spreading disease. This has been a public service announcement provided to you by Planned Parenthood. <laughs> this is your life with the package. <laughs> Let me stop. Let me stop with no, for real, for real, y'all, for real. Stay safe out here. Stay safe out there when, okay, on period. It's, it's not funny, okay? It's not funny, period. I just got a really big sense of humor. <laughs> oh! Make sure that you guys are liking this video. Like this video, like this video, like this video right now. Girl, these pastels, oh girl. Oh, it's a mess. It's a mess. Leave it to the official campaign to bring some clarity to a dusty situation, like I said. Oh, my goodness. All that and more coming up. All that and more coming up. When I got all the receipts today. I hope y'all got time. I hope y'all got time. Okay. What a crown family at? What a crown family at? What a crown family at? Let me see those crowns in the chat. Let me see those crowns in the chat. It's time for our crown family. Bro, call. A dusting we will go. A dusting we will go. Hi, all the Dario. A dusting we will go. Hate Danny Lynn for the win. I know that's right. Let me know where you're watching from when. Okay, on period. It's the official King Pain worldwide. The international official King Pain. The official King Pain household name when. Let me know where you're watching from in the chat. Let me see you dropping crowns in the chat when. The chat should be flooded with crowns. Let's go. It's time for our crown family. Roll call. A dusting we will go. A dusting we will go. Hi, all the Dario. A dusting we will go. That's how the song go, okay? That's how the song go. Don't listen to them other hoes. Okay, I'm here fucking up my shit. Fucking up my shit. Hey, Bella, we got Detroit in the building. What up, though? What up, though? What up, though? Hey, friend. Sharita! Hey, Miss Sharita. How are you, friend? Yeah, he's right. I love you, Miss Sharita. Yes, yeah, LaShawn! Hey, LaShawn, I know that's right. She said, LOL, Conscious TV about to be shaking chicken bones and wig hair on Larry Reed. Girl, he was over there motherfucking exposing Larry Reed. He pretty much confirmed that Larry Reed um, has HIV. What he said, hold on, let me get it. Let me get it. He said, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, 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 hold on. Yeah, he said Larry was over there trying to defend himself against the truth. Pretty much confirming that Larry Reed has HIV. Because that's what the show was about. Larry was defending himself against the HIV allegations. And he said, in the process of defending his own allegations, his truth, he said it was the truth. He was thrown underneath the bus. Oh, yes, Conscious is pissed off. Conscious is pissed off. He's hiding. He's done with Larry. He said the apology needs to be just as big as the motherfucking offense. Larry wants to call him on the phone. Larry wants to apologize behind the scene. Larry wants to come drop off gifts. He said he's tired of the gifts. He said, you're going to stop playing with me. Okay. You're going to have to show that you value me. Okay? Yeah. 
yeah, and if I got to go back to school, if I got to go get me a job down at the Walmart, if I got to go work at the motherfucking Piggly Wiggly, bitch, I'll do that. Because my self-esteem and my pride is more important than getting my reels paid. Let's talk about it. <laughs> Girl, let's talk about it. It's time for our Crown Family Roll Call. Let me see those crowns in the chat. Let me see those crowns in the chat. Hey, King Gemini. Hey, friend. <laughs> I know. That's right. Tremaine. Hey, Tremaine. What's going on? Yes. Uh, Vita. where Vita go? Damn, the chat moving fast. Prophetess. Hey, Prophetess. I know. That's right. <laughs> there go Vita. I know. That's right. Hey, Vita, friend. Kimberly. Hey, Kimberly. What's going on? Guys, uh, like this video, like this video, like this video. Did you like this video? Guys, Jelly. Hey, Jelly. Guys. Uh, oh, oh, quick. We're looking for the quickest Twitter fingers in the chat. We need a number. We need a number. Five to 25. Okay, on period. Ooh. Let's make sure that everyone is remembering to support the show. We can't do it without your support. YouTube is taking 45% out of the official King Pain check. Yes, it is. Yes, please support the show. If you guys are planning on supporting the show, drop some trophies in the chat. That way we can acknowledge you. Okay, I'm here. We love to acknowledge our supporters. Again, we can't do it without your support. Shout out to JLC87 Productions. I know that's right. Oh, oh, I almost forgot. And we made it very easy for you guys to support. The links are in the chat. We got PayPal. Cash app. If you guys need any links, okay, let us know. My moderators will assist you. Okay, on period. Just say something in the chat. They'll drop the link. They'll walk you through it. Whatever we need to do. Again, our preferred donation methods are Cash App, PayPal, Venmo, Zelle. YouTube is trying to take all of my money. Swin, yes, it did. All of it. So support. Yeah, uh, just me. Oh, hey, friend. What's going on? Craft Geek. What's going on? Grand Rising. Yeah. Well, guys, remember to support the show. We're looking for the quickest Twitter fingers in the chat. Okay. What a crown family at? What a crown family at? What a crown family at? Oh, we got Chicago in the building. Good girl. Oh, we got Texas in the house. When I know that's right. Missouri. Yes. Uh, I know that's right. Yes. Birmingham in the building. What's going on? Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, Okay, on period. Oh, okay. What's going on, fam? I know that's right. 22. Can you do something for me? The number of the evening, the number of this morning is 22. So throughout this live, we're going to be asking everyone to support um, by sending $22. Thank you so much, friend. Quickest Twitter fingers in the chat. The rest of the girls was too slow. Y'all got to be quicker than that. Y'all got to be quicker than that win. Y'all got to be quicker than that win. I know that's right. We got. Virginia in the building. Hey, Angela. Guys, oh, oh, let's go ahead and wrap the Crown Family roll call win. Let's go ahead and wrap the Crown Family roll call win. What's going on, everybody? What's going on, everybody? Are you liking this video? How many likes we got on this video? Hold on. Let me go see. How many likes we got on this video? Because y'all know, y'all already know how we do. Y'all already know how we do. We don't start getting into things until we have at least 100 likes on this video and we, we get some support up in here. Yes. Yay, sir. Please support the show. Please support the show. Okay, all support, no matter the size of home period, is appreciated. Yes, it is. Um, Vita wants the number, um, wants the link to the backup channel. Can we get Vita the link to the backup channel, please? Yes, the number of the evening is 22. And thank you so much, Vita, for your support. I know that's right. I know that's right. Like this video, like this video. How many likes we got on this video? When, okay, on period, I'm waiting on you. I'm waiting on you. I'm waiting on you. And that's just how we roll. How we roll. Yes, this is the interactive segment of your day when, okay, on period, this show doesn't move along without you. 
Okay, on period. I need to know that you're watching. I need to know that you're paying attention. I need to know that you're listening and interacting when, okay, on period. Hop out of the bushes. I need everybody hashtagging. Let's go. Let's start this show. Let's start this show. How many likes do we got on this video? Do we have 100 likes yet? Danny Lynn, let me know uh, 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 when to start the show. Let me know when to start the show. Like I said, I got a lot of receipts. We got a lot of receipts. This show is layered. When Tasha K was recently on the Comedy Hot, when we we watched the snippet the other day, when but there was actually a lot more. We actually ran out of time. We ran out of time. We're actually continuing the show from the other night, when okay. But tonight, well, this morning, we really gonna get into some things. We're really going to get into some things when, yes, it did. Like this video, like this video, like this video right now. Oh. Shit. Like this video, like this video, like this video right now. Okay, on period, we need four more likes and some support in the building. Okay, on period, we need four more likes and some support in the building. Guys, uh, oh, did anyone see Conscious? Conscious is live where he was crying. Did anyone get a chance to see Consciousness live when he was crying? Let me know in the chat. This is news, friend. You didn't know? We was actually live when he was live crying. Mm -hmm. I tried to have my people record it, but he took the live down. Mm -hmm. We got some screenshots, though. We got some screenshots, though. Go, go, Jason, waterfalls. Isn't it the reason I think that you used to? I know that you're gonna have it your way. You're not in it all. But I think you're moving too fast. <laughs> oh. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Isn't it the rivers and the stream that you used to? I know that you're gonna have it your way out in it all. But I think you're moving to fire. <laughs> <laughs> Instagram friend it was on Instagram okay on period here oh so we have the likes we have the likes when oh we have the likes you guys just remember to support remember to support when I'm waiting on you I'm waiting on you okay on period my 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 <laughs> oh you seen it my 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 my, 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 girl. He said everything but Larry name. But, I mean, if you've been following, you know exactly what's going on. Okay, on period. He was trying to talk in cold, but we speak we speak in cold over here, too. Okay, on period. Okay, we know the lingo. Okay, on period. We motherfucking speak Ebonics. Motherfucking LGBTQIA. We speak all of it. We in okay, on period. And you paint with all the colors of the wind. <laughs> Oh! My, my, my. 
my, my, my. I'm ready to start this show. I'm ready to start this show. I guess it's too early for some of the girls. I guess it's too early for some of the girls win. Okay, on period. My, my, my. My, my, my. Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video. We need YouTube sending out all our notifications. We need YouTube sending out all our notifications with. <laughs> oh. Yes. Yes. Oh, a quick commercial break while you guys are supporting. Hey there. Hope you're enjoying the content. This quick commercial break is brought to you by Ona Spot Live. I love telling people that purchasing your first spot is not hard at all. You can definitely do it. Many people understand that the first step is the pre-approval, but how do you get that? You need to put a few things together. Here's my official checklist. Ready? Check stubs, bank statements, tax filings, residential history, and your monthly budget. Go back as far as you can, five to seven years is recommended. If you can put these things together, you'll already have much of what you need for your application. You'll be like halfway there. This message has been brought to you by Ona Spot Live. Now let's get back to this fabulous content in five, four, three, two. Y'all got me up in here dusting early this morning when okay on period. Oh, oh, I guess it's too early for some of the girls. I guess it's too early for some of the girls, okay, on period. Oh, is it too dusty on this YouTube street for the girls to come through? Yes, like this video, like this video, like this video, gather in close, gather in close. We got a lot of things to get into. We got a lot of things to get into when I want to see everybody hashtag and let's go. Let's go. My, my, my. My, my, my. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Oh, let's go. Gathering close. Gathering close. I need everybody to have a second. Let's go. Now. As I often state, any story worth being told, should be told from the beginning. Today's story is layered. Today's story is layered. There's three parts. Hopefully we can hit all three parts. That all depends on you. That all depends on you at the top of the docket we have tasha k on comedy hot sounding off on larry reed td jakes eddie long and pastors who are being classified as Members of the LGBT community. My, my, my. Oh, we need some music. We need some music. My, my, my. Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to everybody watching. We, yes, we need some music. Don't touch the look good. <laughs> yes, uh, yes, uh. Touch the always hollering she ain't got it, but she look like she do. She look like she got it, okay, oh, period. And I seen her in person. And I seen her in person. She look good in person, too, okay, on oh, period. The camera don't lie. Look at her, okay, on oh, period. Over there looking like a bag full of money, okay, on oh, period. No wonder Tasha, uh, 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 Cardi is chasing after your ass, okay, on oh, period. 
You supposed to be walking around looking broke. Right? <laughs> Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to everybody watching when uh, everything being shown to you guys during this video is being shown to you guys underneath the fair use and copyright doctrine. It's my opinion. Make the receipts. Take it however you want to take it. Just don't be weird. Okay? We got enough weirdos on these YouTube streets. Okay? We got enough weirdos on these YouTube streets. Like this video. Like this video. Like this video right now. Thank you, Tata. Thank you, Tata. I know what you're talking about. It hasn't been announced publicly yet. So I don't know if I can announce it, but I, I do know what you're talking about. Okay. I do know what you're talking about. And thank you. Okay. Okay. So there's going to be an announcement, though. There's going to be a big announcement soon. Okay. <laughs> and the girls are going to be gagged. Much bigger platform than Flop Soul. Mm hmm. That's all I'm going to say. Okay. Much bigger platform. No okay, here, period. Flop Soul still got a long way to go. Okay, I'm period. Yeah. Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to everybody watching. When remember, sharing is caring. Share this video. Share this video. We need to get the message out. Okay. Tasha K sounds off on Larry Reed, T.D. Jakes, and others on Comedy Hype. Let's see what that were. Swallowed and you can't get up. Now, was that ridiculous when you, when you, when you, <laughs> let me ask you, when was the first time you heard about a T.D. Jakes rumor like that? Oh, I've been new. There's these little gay boys on YouTube that are pastors, right? I exposed them. I don't know if you know who I'm talking about. Yes, I don't know. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. T.D. Jakes was involved with them. Okay. Bishop A.R. Jordan, his son, Messiah, Mansa, whatever his name is. Mansa was uh, supposedly a mentee of T.D. Jakes. Larry Reed. Come in my mouth, read all of you. <laughs> What's he saying? Larry, come in my mouth, read. My, my, my. My, my, my. Have you ever been swallowing? Have you ever gone through a swallowing? My, my, my. 17 or below. Read all of them running together. What you Ooh. running with, niggas? What you running with? For? My, my, my. TD Jakes, Larry Reed, and all of these alleged outed pastors have been running together for years. It's been right in our face, right up under our nose since forever. Are you surprised? Let me know in the chat. That are pastors. What are you doing over there, TD? Mm. Well, it just makes well, me think well, about well, well, Levantre oh. said. Some freaky shit be going on at them convocations. Them all male retreats. Yes, it did. And Larry would have to relieve himself. Okay. The little boys will have to come and relieve Larry so that he wouldn't go on those all men complications and get freaky with the men's. That's what they said. Del Quan and, and, and uh, uh, Levantre. Let's talk about it. The, the late Eddie Long and how that was maybe the first time we saw a black preacher get put in that type of. I don't think Eddie Long was gay. I don't. Well, I love to hear like what why here, 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 you like to hear here it go. There's a clip. Them little boys. First of all, shout out to my late hairstylist William Alexander, who knew the Bishop Eddie Long victims. Mm -hmm. It's a small world in the gay community. Okay, Ooh. them little boys been trying to scheme and sham. And when they did that interview you, Tata, with um the news, I forgot what news station it was, it was, and they asked with CNN, I believe. And they asked, well, what type of things did was there any inappropriateness or sex? We never said there was sex. And it was just things that was inappropriate. Him uh, uh, massaging my shoulders. Musty, okay? Ooh. Ooh. Man, man, man. 
my, my, my. y'all like this video like this video everything being shown to you guys doing this video is being shown to you guys underneath the fair use and copyright doctrine fair use fair use fair use again if you want to see this interview in its entirety make sure that you go and check out comedy hype right here on youtube i'm just saying those are choices that they make these are things that they want to do and of course when you're showing up naked men are going to draw to you and so are women you're doing it for attention no fucking humiliation they like that shit they want to be seen Ooh. you walk out the door naked you're doing it on purpose either you have or you're trying to get high with something Here here. and it don't matter what have you noticed when it comes to celebrities? What do they all have in common? Oh man, they they just they they have an addiction to fame, addiction, and it, it gets to the point where nothing is is off limits. Eighty percent of the shit that I get, I get it from them, and you you know this. I can't. My name can't be attached to this, but I'm gonna drop this on you now. When they call me, they understand. I'm, this is not for your narrative. I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna do what I please with it. You understand what I'm saying? And, I, and I've had them like, God damn, I shouldn't have said nothing. But shit, it's out there now. <laughs> I'm gonna say it my way. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna drag you and that person. If you need to drag me, no. that, that's just, I'm gonna give my honest opinion. You're telling me this, but you participate. So I'm not, no, I'm, I'm not about to just drag this person. Why? I'm equal opportunity over here. You know who the fuck you on the phone with. Now, one thing that I think in just kind of seeing your fan base mm -hmm. and seeing what how did we get here? I'm lost. I'm like, how did we get way over here? How did we get way over there? How did we get way over there? How did we get way over there? What happened? When you when you <laughs> let me ask you, when was the first time you heard about a TD Jake's rumor like that? Oh, I've been new. There's these little gay boys on YouTube that are pastors, right? I expose them. My I bad, don't... my bad, Clown Family Gathering Close. I don't know what didn't happen. The, I don't know what did y'all see when that glitch happened? I think it 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 moved me ahead in the live. I don't know what the fuck just happened. Okay. But gathering close, gathering close. I'm like, thank goodness I didn't watch this about three or four times because I'm like, wait, hold on. That's not where we're supposed to be at. Okay. <laughs> when that comes up, we out of here already. Okay. So I'm, we just want this this part of the segment okay the rest of the segment y'all can go and watch yourself oh i don't know if you know who i'm talking about yes i don't know okay yeah, yeah, yeah. td jakes was involved with them okay. bishop a.r jordan his son messiah mansa whatever his name is mansa was uh supposedly a mentee of td jakes larry reed come in my mouth reed on you 17 or below oh not only if you 17 are below tasha she's not playing with larry Dingleberry! My, my, my. 17 and below, huh? Feed. All of them running together. What you running with niggas? What you running with for? That are pastors. What are you doing over there, TD? Mm. It just makes me think about, of course, um, the, the late Eddie Long. It's the Jake's family values for me. And how that was maybe the first time we saw a black preacher get put in that type of... I don't think Eddie Long was gay. I don't. Well, I'd love to hear, like, what, why. Here, here, you like to hear, here it goes. There's a clip. Them little boys. First of all, shout out to my late hairstylist, William Alexander, who knew the Bishop Eddie Long victims. Mm -hmm. It's a small world in the gay community, okay? Them little boys been trying to scheme and sham. And when they did that interview... With um the news, I forgot what news station it was, it was and they asked, was CNN, I believe. And they asked, well, what type of things did was there any inappropriateness or sex? We never said there was sex. We never said there was anything in a it was just things that was inappropriate. Him uh, uh massaging my shoulders. Now Tasha. Ne never no penetration. But Tasha though, what? I'm not gonna massage a man's shoulders. What? <laughs> I'm not gonna massage. Ah! Tasha, get on my nerves. What? What? I just had that boy over there shook. Okay, over <laughs> Tasha's so good. She had him stuck in this old interview. Y'all gotta go and check it out. Y'all gotta go and check it out. She said, what? You ain't giving no damn massages. Mm, just over here and give me a motherfucking massage, boy. She did. Hey, Skilo friend.
Tessa Gay said they was all right with spending his money. What's wrong with them giving him a massage? Okay. Shit. Larry was over there uh, 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 alive with Kendall uh, uh, giving him a massage to, uh, 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 while he was with uh, 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 William. Oh, you gonna see? You gonna see? I'm gonna pull it out. In the middle of the uh, live with uh, William McCray, Larry must have looked down and said, Kendall. I'm like, where the fuck is Kendall? Where's Kendall at? Clearly, Kendall must have been at his bedside massaging his toes because Larry was laying in the bed. We're going to talk about it. All that and more coming up. Let's go. Massage a man's shoulders. He didn't suck no dick. That's I'm what not, the boy said. I'm not going to massage you. I'm just saying, you're, just, trying to, you're supposed to get me these food. Pastors, I can see Bishop walking behind him. They in there stressed out. And he, you all right, son? You good? But them, I'm just telling you what they said. Like, when they was asked, what, describe what your, I was molested. Mm -hmm. I could describe in detail what my molester did to me. Why can't you describe in detail as multiple young men? Why are you sh shushing the other man? You know, like the, the men who all came forward about Larry Reed. Say their names in the chat. Levantre. Del Quan. Tyshawn, Lester, say his victims' names. When he's trying to talk, there was no sex. There was no penetration. I didn't suck no dick. He didn't suck my dick. So what, what where's the molestation? You took the money that he was giving to you because he was taking... So, how do you suppose Eddie Long got sick, Tasha? Scare you, because your mama and your daddy didn't fucking want you. And when you have father figures, fathers hug sons, they do that. So he's loving on you, like has, as fathers love on their sons, but ain't, he ain't, we ain't never had no sex or nothing like that, but you spent that man's money, bought cars, had DUIs, all types of shit. Only for it to come back to me that y'all plotted this scheme, Ooh. allegedly. I'm just saying, I was molested. I can describe in very detail what my molester did to me. My molester thought we was in a real relationship. This content may be triggering. This content may be triggering. It's not for kids when tell the kids to go on the head out, okay? The wrong folks is talking. Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video. We want YouTube to send out all of our notifications. Make sure that you guys are sharing this video. Share it with a fan. Share it with a friend. We are trying to build the platform, okay? All those interested in building the community, gathering close. I was five, he was 20. That's gotta be, let's just say, you know, Bishop Eddie Long, wasn't a gay man or closeted gay man. Um, let's just say that's just what it is. Maybe he was closeted, but he ain't touched them little boys or cut into them little boys. And that mean, was after they got, yeah, they, no. And you heard that interview, you know what I'm talking about. The only reason why, cause it's, it's a little bit of like, you know, he's been labeled that. He's been labeled like the face of the gay black pastor. But he may be gay, but he ain't touched them little boys. My, my, my. My, my, my. Like there's jokes about it. We had comment up here a ton of jokes will reference Eddie Long. So is Michael Jackson. They investigated that man 10 years, then find go. shit. I gotta oh, go. Oh, touching a white child. <laughs> a white child. Tasha! Like, I'm just saying. Understood. Maybe he is gay, <laughs> but he didn't do nothing to them, according to them. She get on my fucking nerves. Look at her. She is serious as fuck. Look at her face. <laughs> oh, I know that's right. <laughs> oh, she said he, she, he ain't do nothing to the white people, so what? Yeah. So 
so I brought this up because TD Jakes was caught up. It went, it trended. Did you cover that when it trended with Diddy? I didn't need that? to. I covered the pastors he was hanging with. Mm-hmm. And them so niggas like dick. When... My, my, my. My, my, my. You heard it here first. You heard it here first. Okay, I'm here. Them niggas like dick, according to Tasha K. My, my, my. My, my, my. Shout out to Tasha K. Shout out to the Comedy High win. Okay, on period. Um, and the reason I, uh, I played that is because, again, a lot of people reach out to me all the time, ask me what happened between Tasha K and Larry Reed. Because they used to be friends. And a lot of you may have missed it. The fallout occurred on Chelsea Alana's platform, which is not that massive okay uh, uh, uh and she has since taken the video down um but i was there so gathering close leave it to the official campaign to bring some clarity to a uh, dusty situation so tasha k and larry reed pretty much fall out over larry reed's relationship with conscious tv and i'll tell you why Gathering close, gathering close. If you guys remember, Tasha K and Storm Monroe beef came to an explosive head after I exposed that Storm Monroe was talking shit, trash talking Tasha K behind his paywall. He was talking about her titties. He was talking about her pussy. He was talking about her husband. He was talking about the business and how he was just dissatisfied. Okay. So, Chelsea, Alana, and Tasha K, after hearing about what Storm was doing, would host a public roast on her platform and invite Conscious TV over. Whom, of whom at the time they thought was their friend. You guys remember? Any of you guys remember this? Okay. This was because at the time, he would be doing a lot of ass kissing during the whole Bon Ray and Chelsea Alana era. You guys remember the breakup between Bon Ray and Chelsea Alana? You guys following? I need you guys following. I need you guys following. Do I need to slow down? The girls in the back, you guys taking notes? Okay. All right. Shout out to the replay gang. Gang, gang, gang. Okay, on period. You guys can still support after the show. Period. <laughs> yes, to do here. The support feature is always on 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Okay, 366 days out the year. Okay, on period. You can support the show whenever you get through. Um, It was during the whole Bomb Ray and Chelsea Alana era where Conscious would be doing a whole lot of brown nosing and trying to get in with Tasha K, Kiwi Studios. You know, he's trying to get in close with Tasha K and all of them. They were bringing a lot of attention and numbers to his platform. You know, during that time, his platform grew significantly. Um, you know, and this will be because Tasha K, Chelsea, Vaughn, and Storm all will go and frequent his platform during the whole breakup era. So when they were dragging Storm, okay, Tasha K was like, hey, let's tie Conscious TV in. Again, they thought he was their ally and they didn't think nothing of bringing him on the show, okay? Like this video, like this video, like this video right now. So here's what happened. Here's what happened, okay? Again, Larry Reed and Tasha K will fall out because of Conscious TV and Larry Reed's relationship. Pay attention, okay? Here's what happened. Apparently, Conscious TV had developed a hatred towards Tasha K after discovering that Larry Reed lost his court case to Bishop E. Dewey 
and they blamed Tasha for recommending her lawyer, Olga, to Larry. Y'all following? Y'all following? Tasha, Tasha K thought Conscious was her friend. Conscious went from liking Tasha K to hating Tasha K overnight, all because Larry Reed would lose his litigation. The litigation that he was in with Bishop E. Dewey, okay? Put a star next to that name, Bishop E. Dewey. Girls in the back, pay attention. Put a star next to that name. We're going to come back to that. We're going to come back to that, okay? They blame Tasha K for recommending Olga. You guys all remember Olga. <laughs> you guys all remember Olga. Hey, Olga. <laughs> hey, Tasha. Yay, yeah, so shout out to everybody watching. I'm sure there's some girls in the bushes. Okay, right now, okay? You guys all remember Olga. Olga uh, uh, was Tasha K's attorney for the whole Cardi B versus Tasha K bout, okay, on period. And we all, you know, remember how that turned out, okay, to this day. To this day. <laughs> oh my 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 <laughs> oh so they they they's mad at uh Tasha they's mad at Tasha about Olga um according to Conscious TV um Olga you know she's a bad attorney okay um, and as a result, Larry would lose his litigation, his lawsuit with Bishop E. Dewey by default. Okay, and I'll tell you guys more about that in a moment. So what happened between Conscious TV, Larry, and Tasha. So like I said, Conscious TV would develop a hatred for Tasha overnight, okay? Um, and apparently, Larry Reed told Conscious TV that he felt some type of way, that it was Tasha K's fault that he lost this lawsuit, but he did not tell Tasha. So unbeknownst to Tasha, okay, she got conscious on her ass and Larry Reed hasn't even expressed to Tasha K, his friend in real life, how he feels. Okay? So when Tasha K and Chelsea opted to tag conscious into the roast, it backfired big time because conscious TV mad his lover lost the lawsuit would then proceed to try and drag Tasha K and call her out. Larry Reed is in debt because of you, Tasha K. That's what he said. Tasha K said, wait, what the fuck are you talking about? What are you talking about? Mind you, she didn't bring him here to talk about Larry. She brought him over to talk about Storm. Okay, we dragging Storm today. We'll talk about Larry after the show. With, like, what the fuck you got going on? You okay? Conscious sitting up there like this. Who remembers Conscious sitting up there like this? Like Tasha owe him something. You know, and Tasha kind of like, what? What the fuck is going on? He said, because of you, Larry Reed lost that lawsuit. Tasha K said, I'm going to advise you to be quiet right now because 
you don't know what you're talking about. And she said, I don't want to have to expose some shit. That's what she said. She said, just like that. She said, I don't want to have to expose some shit. She said, uh, 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 you need to go talk to Larry uh, 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 because you're doing too much. Okay. Conscious TV, boastful. Okay. He says, when it comes to Larry Reed, I know everything. Especially when it comes to said case with Bishop E. Dewey, alleging that he was a part of the public legal defense. Okay. Which pretty much means that he was windmilling for Larry, girl. <laughs> he was fighting for Larry online. Okay. He was part of the public defense. Whatever that means. Okay. On period. Tasha K said, oh, yeah. Well, did you know that Larry Reed took, I mean, he, he, he forced her hand. He forced her hand. Okay. She had to expose him at this point. Okay. She said, do you know that Larry Reed took that $25,000 you guys helped him raise to help him with this lawsuit? And he bought new jewelry with it. Yep. Pick your mouth up. Okay, I'm here here. Conscious TV didn't know what to do. Tasha K said, yeah. Betty didn't tell you that. I bet he also didn't tell you that Olga paid for the lawsuit out of her own pocket the debt that Larry incurred, she paid because she felt as though it was her fault that Larry received the default judgment. Apparently something got sent in late and there was a default judgment, okay? And Larry lost. And they blamed Tasha K because Tasha K recommended Olga. And again, Conscious TV would go from kissing Tasha K's ass, loving you know, her shitty draws, allegedly, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> it's a joke. Um, to hating Tasha K overnight. 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 And this left Tasha K scratching her head. Okay. So as I stated earlier in this live, at the time, Tasha K and Larry were really good friends. And Larry has never mentioned conscious TV. Oh, wait, 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 wait. So yeah. So at the time, Tasha K and Larry Reed were really good friends. And according to Tasha, Larry Reed had never mentioned Conscious TV to her. I mean, they've supped together. They've been to each other's homes. They've been out to eat together. Their kids know each other. In addition, okay, Larry didn't told Tasha K that he not gay. So what the fuck is he doing hanging out with a bitch like you? She's like, how do you know Larry? Have you met Larry? And, you know, Conscious is like, you know, don't worry about how I know Larry. Okay. So Conscious is up there. We're milling. We're milling for his lifetime. Okay. Um, Larry, this and that. I know everything about Larry. So eventually, Chelsea drops him from the show. Tasha Case then advises Chelsea to get Larry Reed on the phone. Contra TV was up there acting like a girlfriend defending her man. Those were her exact words. She said the conscious was acting like Larry Reed's girlfriend and he was defending his man. Hold on to that. And again, he was sitting up there like this. As if Tasha owed him something because of a lawsuit that he alleges that he was a part of the public defense.
She said, get Larry, get Larry Reed on this live. Okay. She's pissed. They no longer worried about Storm. They want to talk to Larry. Okay. Um, so mind you, Tasha K didn't expose Larry. Okay. Anybody else would be pissed off. Anybody else would be pissed off. Larry Reed come on the show very, very apologetic. Acting like he don't know what he did to Tasha, but he's he's he apologizes and Tasha K like no fuck all that fuck what are you what because remember he told T conscious that he felt away but he did not tell Tasha K so Tasha K is like fuck all that okay. How you know Conscious TV? <laughs> oh, she said, fuck all that. How you know Conscious? Because this nigga acting weird. She said, this nigga acting weird. Larry goes, well, I really don't know him like that. This was Larry Reed's exact words, bitch. I was like, what? What? He said, I really don't know him like that. Larry Reed said, I really don't know him like that. <laughs> that's how I caught you with Will Miller for him. Like, you know, that's how I caught you with Will Miller for him. Okay. Larry Reed said, I don't, I don't know him like that. He's a, he's just a fan. Tasha K said, really? You never met him? Larry says, nah. She said, because he was up here acting like he was your girlfriend or something. And, and then Larry kind of explains the relationship again. You know, Larry is alleging that, you know, he is just someone who's seen him online, who is a, a really big fan. He's just a fan. And for me, this was alarming. Because I had been working with Conscious TV prior to on the gentleman's panel. And I, I'm sure if you ask the men that was on the gentleman's panel, they will tell you the same. Conscious TV was alleging that there was more to his and Larry's relationship. Like the only reason I knew who Larry was is because of conscious like i didn't even know who he was when conscious was telling me about him i kind of put two and two together that day during the live that was my first time laying eyes on larry reed okay and i was really only able to put the two together because conscious was appeared on the show too it was like oh well that's the larry he was telling me about oh, okay didn't know who larry was didn't know his history didn't know anything about larry that was the first time i would lay eyes on Larry was doing that live show. Okay. Again, this was alarming to me because I worked with Conscious TV, you know, in the past on a panel for like, what, a year or so. And, you know, we got close, you know, we would talk behind the scenes and, you know, he, he would tell me things. Okay. On period. You know, on the show, he was like my ratchet twin. Okay. Back in my ratchet days. <laughs> so Concert TV was alleging there was more to the uh, relationship. Okay. Um, he would tell me that, you know, he and Larry met. Okay. And that they've gone on rendezvous. He would call it rendezvous. That was his exact word. Uh, words. And, you know, Larry would fly him out, put him in hotels. You know, they would eat. Um, at, you know, at, at fine dining restaurants, you know, um, Larry was paying all his bills, purchased him, purchased him a car, um, so on and so forth, you know. So that night after the live, I did a reaction video to the fallout. And it's still up. You got to go check it out. Okay, on period. On my news feed. That following morning, I would receive a call from Larry Reed. 
Larry Reed would then call my phone threatening to sue me. Said that if I I, I didn't stop. Saying that he was gay. That he was sue me. But I heard what I heard, and I know what I know. And I don't have no reason to allow you. I don't even fucking know you. I told him if there was an issue with what Conscious TV told me, then you should go to Conscious because I know what I know. And he said what he said. And if it was a lie, you wouldn't be calling me right now. You wouldn't be threatening to sue me. A wise person once told me that a hit dog holler, and this is exactly what a hit dog would do. I ain't even out the bed good. See, because the fish king painted on the morning person. I ain't even out the bed good, and this whole, this bar head hole calling me, threatening to sue me. Oh, it was a day. Oh, that was a day. Okay, on period on that day. Okay, and Tasha K, uh, 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 she know. Okay, on period, the girls know. Tasha K on my, all the girls they know. Okay, everybody was a part of that conversation except for unconscious. Again, he 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 was never really valued. He's never been a valuable asset, a valuable part of Larry's team. He's always just been, you know, expendable. So even then he wasn't included, but there was a conversation had between myself, Tasha K, Armand Wiggins, and Larry. Because Larry would then also allege that he was going to sue Tasha K. Because everyone was trying to spin these narratives about who's saying what. But the source of the information was Conscious TV. And like Larry has done in the past, you know, he rather attacked the people who are spreading, you know, the message than the person who started the rumor. So, you know, you got to go to the source. You got to go to the source. So that's how our beef began. That's how Larry Reed and my beef would begin. And just so it's noted, okay, before I exposed Larry Reed and Conscious TV's relationship, Conscious and I had already felt fallen out because Conscious would try to set me up for Chelsea Alana and would record me without my consent. And ever since then, we haven't we haven't been cool. Period. I've given him the opportunity to apologize, but you know, I guess he felt like the Kang after that. That's where the Kang came from. That's when he started calling himself the kangaroo of the YouTube streets. Um, after he called himself trying to set me up, you know, they wanted to know pretty much who my source was. And again, you know, I got to protect my sources. I got to protect my sources. So I pretty much just told him that, you know, my source was somebody in their camp. Let them hoes chase their motherfucking tail. But because he played in my face, I had to cut that hoe off. I'm like, girl, don't play with me. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Because, you know, everything's just not content. Period. 
my friends, they're not content. Okay, on period. But if you decide that you want to be my enemy, okay, on period, I'll add your raggedy, rusty neck, crusty, stale wig, have an ass onto the motherfucking docket. Let's talk about it. Okay? So it was really no tea when I exposed Larry and Conscious because, you know, I was going to get my lick back either way. Period. Period. Hugger to the period. I was going to get my lick back either way. Okay. So that's how our beef began. Uh, 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 uh. Larry, you know, he, he, he started threatening me and I began doing my research. Period. That's that's what we do on the YouTube. We I began doing my research, and pretty much everything else is history. Like I said, all of the videos are still up. You know, all the videos are still up. All the videos are still up. Okay, yay! Yeah, so, uh... so as you guys can see, Conscious TV has been windmilling for Larry for a while now, jeopardizing friendships, opportunities. Ooh amongst other things for what he's calling a sugar baby lifestyle, okay, on period. You guys heard it here first, okay? Conscious TV has come forward confirming that he has been in a sugar daddy, sugar baby relationship with Larry. A fish campaign has all the receipts gathering close. Gathering close, okay, on period. Cry! girl he's been crying girl real tears okay on period larry don't love him no more larry is back with his uh oh uh, 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 boo uh william mccray win okay on period what they said they reunited and it fell so good what he said we reunited because you understood okay what larry said he said larry he said larry Larry said he remembers what that were. Yes, he did. And he said, William, you was the best. <laughs> oh, he said, you was the best. The best I ever had, the best I ever was, the best I ever will be. Yes, they had a moment. They really had a moment when, okay, oh, period. Reunited and it felt so good. Yes, it did. They had a moment with, okay, oh, period. We're going to review it. <laughs> Official Keep got all the receipts with. And Conscious TV is mad because, you know, Conscious TV, uh, 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 like he did Tasha, you know, cut her off for Larry and, and started, he did the same thing to uh, uh, William and so many others. Can't look like no fucking fool and, and rekindle things with William after all that he did. Like, he's going to look fucking stupid. Then people are going to know. Like, he, he, clearly he, he's Larry's puppet. Larry is controlling things. Larry's controlling him. He's on the payroll. Like, Conscious TV feels that people are not going to receive this well. What are people going to think if they if he all of a sudden is sitting with William and you after everything that you guys did to William McCray? That you guys did to William McCray. That you had conscious do. To William McRae. Conscious said, I'm sick of this shit. Okay. I'm, I'm tired of this old, decrepit, frail fool making me look like a fool. That's what he said. I got all the receipts. I got all the receipts. He said, I'm tired of Larry making me look like a fucking fool. He said, I'm tired of this shit. He said, I'm sick of this shit. That's what he said. Oh, <laughs> uh, you said, you know. It was fun while it lasted. Okay, the sugar baby lifestyle. He said it was fun while it lasted. Where you know maybe he'll find another sugar daddy along, uh, 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 uh the, you know the lines. I doubt it. I doubt it. Okay, I'm here. And ain't nobody really checking for you like that. Conscious win. Okay, I'm here. Um, 
you know, it's just, you know, the confusion of it all. Um, but, you know, he's planning on going back to school and getting a little job at the local grocery store or something um, so that he can make ends meet because he don't want no more Larry's money. Okay, I'm here. He don't want no more of that money uh, until Larry changes. He said Larry going to have to change if he want us to be together. If he wanted there to be a us, if he want there to be a us, he going to have to change, period. He said, I'm not coming back unless there's a change. Period. Period. He said he values his self-respect more than he values that check. Period. My, my, my. Seems as though Conscious TV found his ball somewhere. Y'all know that I'm a comedian, right? Okay, on period. Yes, I'm a bunch of panties. Some of these people taking my jokes too serious. <laughs> oh! Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video, win. Oh! Oh, the number of the evening. The number of the morning is 22. Hop out of the bushes, support the show, win. Okay, I'm here. Keep the show going. Like I told you, this is a layered show. This is a layered show. That was layer one. That was layer one. That was layer one. Keep the show going. Keep the show going. Hop out of the bushes and support. We got Cash Up, PayPal, Venmo, Zelle. Okay, I'm here. Layer two. Okay, I'm here. You guys ready? You guys ready? Show me you're ready. Show me you're ready. This is the interactive segment of your day. I need YouTube to fucking go crazy right now. I need everybody liking this video, sharing this video, commenting on this video, supporting this video, wherever it is that you can fucking do, do it right now. Do it right now. I don't want everybody just going crazy. Just go crazy right now. Go crazy right now. Like this video, subscribe to this video, share this video, comment, 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 comment. It's up and it's stuck here in the home of the situation. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, on period. Plus, we've been here an hour and a half. Okay, on period. Yes, if you guys want to keep the show going, okay, on period. We need at least another hour, two, maybe three hours. Okay, on period. I need you to hop out of the bush to support the show. Okay, on period. We got Cash App, Super Chat, Venmo, Zell, Crypto. Okay, on period. The number of the evening is 22. Okay, if you guys are planning on supporting the show, look. We ain't got time to be holding the show up. We got a lot of shit to get into. If you plan on supporting the show, let me see some trophies in the chat so we can acknowledge you right now. So we can acknowledge you right now. Let me see some trophies in the chat right now. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so remember uh, Bishop E. Dewey. Remember Bishop E. Dewey? I was talking about him earlier. Okay? And I told you that this is Lair. I told you we was taking a trip down memory lane. I told you that was part of the reason that Larry Reed and Tasha K fell out because he lost the lawsuit to Bishop E. Dewey, okay? Well, Bishop E. Dewey just so happens to be yes, friend of the show, Daryl Moore's fraternity brother, which is part of the reason that Daryl Moore and Larry Reed will ultimately begin beefing. I'll tell you guys more about it in just a moment. Hey, Jelly, thank you very much. Yes, yeah, layer two, child. Layer two. You guys ready? You guys ready for layer two? Show me you're ready by supporting the show. Show me you're ready by supporting the show. And there's many ways to support. You can support this video right now just by liking. You can support this video right now by subscribing to the show. You can support this video right now by sharing this video in, okay, on period. And you can support this video right now in a monetary way. The links are pinned. If anybody needs a link, let us know. If anybody needs a link, let us know. Let us know. Let us know. We're waiting on you. We're waiting on you. Layer number two is coming to you fast. Coming in the hot wind, okay, on period. Well, as fast as y'all want it. As fast as y'all want it, wind, okay, on period. A lot of y'all want me to wait till your lunch break. Is that what that were? Y'all want me to wait till your lunch break start? Okay, on period. I can start whenever y'all want me to start with. Okay, on period. I got time today. I got time today with. I can start whatever you want me to start. Okay, on period. But if you want this show to start right now, okay, on period. Layer two. Layer two. Okay, on period. Because it's a layered show. Oh, yes. And I'm pulling out the receipts. I'm pulling out the receipts. This is a layered show. If you're ready for layer two to start, Hop out of the bushes, like this video, like this video, support this video. The number of the evening is 22, 22, 22. Can you do something for King? Okay, on period. 
Oh. Oh. Ma, ma, ma. Oh. Guys, uh, Bishop E. Dewey. Guys. Guys. Shout out to being beautiful. Being beautifully honest. Thank you, friend. I know that's right. I know that's right. I almost missed you. Yeah, yeah so. No, friend, he really said these things. I'm not making nothing up. Okay, I'm period. Stay tuned. Stay tuned when I'm pulling out the receipts. Everything I can say can be backed up with a receipt. Okay, I'm period. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. I'm pulling out the receipts now. I'm pulling out the receipts now. I was just waiting for the girls in the back to uh, uh, support the show. Security! Can you take the collection plate around? Okay, on period. This is a business. Uh, we got to make sure the business is business. And we can't be here all day if they're not supporting. Okay? I can't be here for another hour or so if we don't get some support in the building when, okay, on period. Support the show so that we can stay. Period. Oh, the producer's going to come and cut off the lights. The producer's going to come and cut off the lights, okay, on period. Yes, it did. Layer two. Everybody hashtag layer two. Everybody hashtag layer two. Everybody hashtag layer two. Jazzy the baddie. Hey, friend. Deborah Carr, what's going on? We all need to try and support the platforms that keep us informed and entertained. Thank you, friend. I'm going to let that sit there for a second. I'm going to let that sit there for a second. Everybody hashtag layer two. Everybody hashtag layer two. You guys ready for layer two? I'm waiting on you. Okay, show me you ready for layer two by supporting the show. Okay, on period. Show me you ready for layer two by supporting the show. Y'all, yeah, I'm waiting on you, honestly. I wait on you. Layer two, layer two, layer two. Layer two, layer two. How many likes we got on this video, Danny? We got 400 people in the building. We should have at least 400 likes. Can you check for me, please? Period. We got to make sure our business is businessing. Ooh. Like this video, like this video, like this video. We need YouTube sending out all our notifications. We need YouTube sending out all of our notifications. Okay, on period. Yes, hashtag layer two. Layer two. Layer two. Layer two. Layer two. If you guys are ready for layer two to start, remember to support the show. Remember to support the show. Oh, oh, I know we can do a lot better than this. We have 235 likes. We have 430 people in the building. Hop out of the bushes and like this video. Like this video. Like this video. Like this video. Win. Okay. The more you like, the less you have to support. Okay. <laughs> you know why? Because YouTube sends out our notifications and more people come in. More people come into the building. Okay. With support. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Like this video. Like this video. Like this video. We want YouTube sending out all our notifications. We need YouTube sending out all of our notifications when remember to support the show. Remember to support the show. Remember to support the show. Okay. Because I trust that you guys are going to support. And I seen some trophies in the chat when we gotta we gotta keep the show going. We gotta keep the show going. Uh, 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 at least let me get some more content out before we have to end the live. Okay. Yes. Let me, at least let me get some more content out before we have to end the live. Um Yes, if you guys want to keep this live going, you know what to do. You know what to do. Hop out of the bushes and support, okay? Um, layer two, okay? So, again, remember I was telling you guys about Bishop E. Dewey, okay? Apparently, 
him and Larry um, were in a legal litigation back in the day, and Larry ultimately lost, okay? Bishop E. Dewey just so happens to be Daryl Moore's fraternity brother, okay? And Larry, according to Daryl, took some hush money from Bishop. And they went into contract. Larry Reed breached the contract. And E. Dewey sued Larry for $260,000. And he lost. Default judgment. That's why they blame Olga. That's why they blame Tasha. Thank you. Thank you, Tiffany. Thank you for be being beautiful. Thank you, Freya. Thank you for all the support. You guys are amazing. You guys are amazing. Okay, on period. $260,000. Bishop E. Dewey won from Larry Reed. Because Larry did not honor their contract that they had. Larry was supposed to stop talking about E. Dewey. But instead of talking about him, what did he do? He had his minion, Conscious TV, drag him instead. So he sued him and Larry lost. Okay. Daryl Moore discussed it in his recent video. Okay, we're going to take a look at the receipts. We're going to take a look at the receipts. Gather them in close, gather them in close. Like I said, this is a layered video on today. This is a layered video on today. Three parts, three parts. I hope that we make it through all three parts. I mean, you know, I, I, I take pride in my content. Okay, I work hard on my shit. Don't nobody else create these long form videos like the official campaign. Don't nobody keep you entertained all day like the official campaign. Make sure that you guys are supporting the show because we can't do it without your support. We can't. We can't. I just, you know, would not be here if you guys were not supporting. Okay. Yeah, it was uh I don't know. This uh, the YouTube makes it that way. Okay, on period. Charge it to the uh, 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 game and not my heart. Okay, on period. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Unless somebody got a house they were trying to give away. <laughs> I got to work, okay, on period. And I work hard for my money. I work hard for my money. So hard for my money. I'm not out here selling dookie snacks like motherfucking uh, conscious now. Okay, on period. I'm not out here selling dookie snacks. I'm out here working and entertaining the masses so that I can acquire the things that I want in life. And that's just period. Guys, yeah, uh, I've chosen a career path and I gotta motherfucking uh, climb the ladder of success. Yes, I did. Oh, so shout out to everybody here that's supporting uh the movement. My 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 <laughs> shout out to my friend Daryl Moore. He had actually uh sent me a photo before this live uh, uh with him in his crown. <laughs> uh everybody wanna be the king. Okay, on period. Oh, somebody, is anybody going to tell me over there looking like the kangaroo? <laughs> that, ain't, that ain't my crown friend. That ain't my crown friend. That's that, that's that other girl crowd. Okay, over here. <laughs> that's the kangaroo crown. Okay, over here. <laughs> oh, hopefully you guys are ready to get into some things because this video is her. Huh? hilarious okay on period girl the end the, the intro of this video girl daryl moore had me on the fucking floor this video is <laughs> if you guys want to see this video in its entirety you make sure that you guys are following daryl moore right here on youtube and subscribe okay on period this fucking video bitch 
This fucking video bait chat me on my fucking back. And here's why. Watch this. <laughs> this guy right here. Oh, music. Is that how you do it? Music. Something like that, man, girl. Turn this damn music on. Okay, I'm here. Everything being shown to you guys doing this video is being shown to you guys underneath the fair use and copyright doctrine. <laughs> yes, that part. Oh, that shit is so fucking fatty. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let them let them see it. Let this see it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Everybody about to get this smoke tonight. Y'all already know the mood I'm in. <laughs> mm -mm. Yeah, you better might want to blow me up on TV if you got a Roku. Cause I'm about to cut up. I'm gonna have a whole house rock. Oh lordy, mm -mm -mm. tonight. Second unofficial sponsor is. <laughs> oh yeah, we know, we know you're not talking about me, Fred. Yeah, that's but we know, we know who you talk about. Okay, O'Perry. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I didn't take no offense to it. Oh, okay, oh, period. I wasn't even thinking that at all. Okay, oh, period. We know exactly where the energy is being directed. Okay, on oh, period. We can prove it. Shout out to in the palace. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> Shout out to King Payne. King Payne, I told y'all I was going to cut up, boy. I told y'all I was going to act a fool tonight, boy. Oh, Lord. Mm-mm. That's right. 10 for Reynolds rap. <laughs> Speaking of Reynolds rap. Oh, oh we up to 100. I can go and get started. I something came across my desk. <laughs> and uh and I saw this. And you know, y'all, y'all might be a little squeamish tonight, but I am I'm, I'm it's Friday and I'm I'm going I'm going in. Now see y'all used to get on me about this here. And y'all said this was too much. <laughs> Y'all said this was a little too much. So, this ain't nothing compared to what I got across my day. Oh, this is only the beginning. This is Bishop OnlyFans right here. This is before he gained weight. A dusting we will go. <laughs> a dusting we will go. I all the dairy on a dusting we will go. My, 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 what's that black ring around his thighs? And look like a butterball turkey. He don't look like that. Man. He look like this here right now. He look like this here. <laughs> <laughs> so, here we go. Y'all ready? Y'all, if y'all ready, put a, put a, put a, uh, put a, a one in the chat if y'all ready for me to go on it. Put a one in the chat if y'all ready. Hit a what in the chat if y'all ready, okay? Dale Boy said, "Hit a what in the chat if y'all ready, okay?" Well, period. Y'all ready for this? Oh, oh y'all not ready for this. Y'all not ready for this, okay? <laughs> <laughs> there is no way that anybody could be prepared for what <laughs> what's next. Let me see some ones in the chat. Let me see some ones in the chat. Okay, <laughs> I know that's right, Jude J. Yes, this is the interactive segment of your day. This is the interactive segment of your day. Let me see some ones in the chat, girl. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Video. They're gonna play about three, four times. I'm gonna keep playing <laughs> and I'm gonna keep laughing and roasting because somebody <laughs> told him. That it was a good idea and that he looked good doing it. So I'm about to go in before I get my show started. Get oh, I, get I know some of y'all is out, <laughs> but uh, yeah, we we gonna we gonna keep it rolling. Lord have mercy. Mm -mm -mm. And, and some of y'all don't get it right now, but you will when you see this video. Tonight's <laughs> episode is brought, brought to you also by unofficially by Butterball Turkey with all that trimming wrapped in tin foil. Mm -hmm. So brace yourself, ladies. And gentlemen. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, blessed be the fruit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And he was gonna lie on the cigar blotter show. I can't even.
You know it's gonna get played again in case you missed it. Oh, my, my, my. <laughs> I was laughing all <laughs> oh, night. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Y'all got to get into the walk. Y'all got to get into the walk. Y'all got to get into the gift. Y'all got to get into the aluminum foil of it all. Oh, MG. Now, I seen this when it came across my timeline. He did this right after we did that fucking... Uh, podcast with tasha k wine it's a new tea oh my goodness the make sure that you guys are following tasha k's show wine it's a new tea okay that podcast giving the girls a run for their money my 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 girl girl so i i definitely seen it okay because you know he had we had just you know he had uh took me off the block list so you know speaking of the block list conscious tv that blocked me girl what you blocked me for? I never did anything to you. Bitch, you the one did something to me. You the one did something to me. <laughs> what did I just see? Girl. Girl. <laughs> exactly why y'all should be supporting the show. Okay, yo, period. Because you know this going to be lit. Okay, yo, period. Guys. Uh... All I could pin in my head was. You me feel <laughs> so very real. <laughs> 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 it's raining, man. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Take a leg drive. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Somebody, one of my one of my supporters said it looked like he had two cashew nuts wrapped in tinfoil. <laughs> he said, you definitely know he ain't on top. He's definitely a power bottom. And them little cashew nuts were wrapped right, in dude, this don't have shit to do with nothing. I just wanted to laugh. <laughs> Well, I said, oh my, fix it, Lord Jesus. So we're going to look at it one more time. So in case you missed it, here we go. Oh, one yeah. Send it to us. Send it to us. Send it to us. The official key page. Oh, you got my email at gmail.com. Here we go. Here we go. A turkey wrap. Oh, <laughs> look at the walk. Hold on, it's the walk for me. Oh, let me see you walk, 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 walk. Do we play it again? It's the definitely walk. Definitely no hand on top. He's definitely a power bottom. <laughs> and them little cashew nuts was wrapped in tinfoil. I said, oh my. Uh, so we're going to look at it one more time. So in case you missed it. Look at this walk. Look at the walk. Look, look at the walk. He know he had no business in the fucking hills. Okay. They have to ready to bust his damn face. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I can't breathe. I can't breathe. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Why? Why? Fix it, Jesus. Please, Jesus. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What did uh let me see? Oh, let's see what my friend said. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 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 oh, it's got music and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this one not as bad. This is not as bad. But this this aluminum foil shit <laughs> is a mess. <laughs> Make sure that you guys are liking this video, sharing this video, and supporting this video. The links are in the chat. Weird. Okay, so let's get into uh uh, uh <clears throat> what that were. 
What's going on? What didn't happen when? <laughs> you did that on purpose. <laughs> you did that on purpose. You went and got a glue gun and some glitter, and you went over there to the craft store. And I see where all the um, rhymes <coughs> that you don't even put on the crowns went. You bought you a pair of heels <coughs> from uh, City Trends or uh, 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 what's that one? Rainbow. You went and bought you a pair of boots, and you and you been dazzling for the girls. <laughs> oh, pretty pussy pink lips, baby. <laughs> exactly. That's what I was about. To, I was about to say that. Uh, yeah, my that man. The, the rings wig that he had. Only thing he was missing was a bow and arrow. <laughs> <laughs> That's all thing he was missing. Uh, that 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 troll, uh, or whatever he was, with the Lord of the Rings. Yeah, you bedazzled your <laughs> disco boots, your stripper. Oh boots. shit! You did that on purpose. You actually, you actually <laughs> stood up in your house <laughs> or in that store before you got home. And said, "I'm gonna kill him with this." And then you went over there to Party City. You got that uh, Lord of the Rings. <laughs> And he bought you some um, fabric, um, Joanne's fabric, and, fall, and you bought that. Um, oh, oh. That, uh, let me see your transcript. Said, I'm never going to think of Jiffy popcorn the same again. <laughs> Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video. My, 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 my. That tinfoil material. And you said, I'm going to kill him with this. I'm going to kill him. And you put a cape on and you had them boots bedazzled, the bedazzled boots and them nut crushers on and nut crusher onesie made out of tinfoil. And uh, you thought that was sexy. All you people that was in them comments when I looked at that video, they was, they was gassing him up and hyping him up. You, know, you thought that was sexy. Uh, <laughs> shame on you. Uh, in a minute. But see, shame on you. Everybody did that. <laughs> yes, kill. There's a bird king crowd. I'm the sponsor tonight, show. And, uh, mm -hmm. See, you were sitting there. I bet you bought the wig. You bought that material over at Joanne's Fabrics. And you got them crafts over there at Michael's or the Hobby Lobby. And you got some glue and a glue gun. You're you like, oh, I'm going to kill him with this. Oh. You had the pizza thing going. And uh, had your little acorns up in the front screaming for bloody murder. As, as one of my supporters said, look like two cashews wrapped up in some mm. tinfoil. You had that Lord of the Rings wig on, and you was rocking it with your black edges underneath or whatever that you know, because you ain't got no hair. And uh, <laughs> you thought that you did that on purpose. That's what I'm getting at. You didn't do that by accident. <laughs> yeah, he had on JLC eighty seven. He had on a Nutcrusher two thousand outfit. <laughs> that was jive. Like he took a, a prison jumpsuit and spray painted it with some silver paint, <laughs> some metallic silver. You did that on purpose. <laughs> Let me move this mic. You did that on purpose. <sighs> mm. We thought the OnlyFans thing was a bit much. We thought the picnic table panties was much <laughs> for a former Koji elder and preacher. But when you did this, 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 uh, I can't even, I'm trying to mind the word, but when you did this, 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 uh, uh, oh, hell, when you did this fuckery right here, <laughs> um and exactly i know she's mad as hell because you know one of the, one of the one people on the cell block that got internet and said girl look at your son <laughs> i hope you get paroled this year mm. lord i tell you lord i tell you mm. that must have revival mm. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> You were wearing them nut crusher 3000s. I didn't want it from 2000, 3000. Lord, how much? You should risk the food. And, uh. Now somebody said it to his mama in prison. I am done. I am done. Girl, look at your son. He <laughs> <laughs> get on my fucking No. <laughs> <laughs> now somebody showed it to his mama in prison. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
I ain't know whether you look like a baked potato, but then I said, you know, my, 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 you know, I'm cracking jokes with people. And they said, damn, he like Miss Piggy. And then when I saw that Miss Piggy, I said, there she is. There she is, Miss America. Okay. Oh, okay. oh shit. Dude. You know when that little thing when you put a turkey in the oven and uh, and when it's, when it's ready, the little thing pop up, go, oh, oh, shit. Mm-hmm. You was on some intergalactic foolishness. I'm talking. I'm talking about <coughs> space odyssey. Uh, 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 anyway, uh, okay, let's that. get serious. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> he get off my fucking ass. <laughs> Oh shit, that was fucking funny as fuck. Oh, <laughs> oh. he said he has no friends. <laughs> he said he has no friends. <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> Whoever let him walk outside like that is clearly not his friend. Okay. <laughs> oh shit! We got the network, Daryl. We definitely got the network because I I do stand up too. Okay, well, period. Fuck is you talk about? You do everything I do. Shit, you got a, a, a production company. You do stand up. Man. My, my, my. Yeah, we got a network. I'm going to reach out. Okay. Oh, so Daryl, he, he's, he's ready to be serious. He's he's, get, he's getting ready to get into some things when, okay, on period. Okay. Now, let's get back on track. Let's get back on track. Okay. Go back to Bishop E. Dewey in your notebooks, everybody. <laughs> okay, go back to Bishop E. Dewey in your notebooks, everybody. <laughs> oh, according to Daryl Moore, Larry Reed took the hush money from his fraternity brother, Bishop E. Dewey, okay, and then breached the agreement. Bishop sued him, won the money, $260,000. And if you guys remember, from layer one, that was the reason that Tasha K. And Larry Reed fell out. Period. Layer two. So, let's get down to business. Another thing came across my desk this week. I, I can't watch because I'm blocked. But uh, it seems that uh, two old friends and enemies are now friends again. And uh, I have theories as to why they're friends again. And we shall hey, discuss Ava, hey, cousin. So let me get my notes here. I type notes. I actually type some notes. So it seems that William McCray and Larry Reed have been reunited like Peaches and her. Reunited. Because he, William McCray even busted out singing. Reunited. And it feels so good. <laughs> so, I couldn't stomach to watch the whole video. So, I fast forwarded. So, you know, he takes him 45 years to get to the point of why he's shooting the video. Greetings, 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 and all that. And, and all this stuff. So, I said, whatever, whatever, whatever. And, uh, so, I got to the part where uh, his partner in crime is new. Thing, my doodle. Laying up in the bed, talking to men's is off the camera on his end. So, I said, Look at this foolishness right here. Right. Hey, cousin, so I, said, I couldn't watch it at night. People are like, Down there, you watch this funny. I'm like, funny about this. 
because uh. it's a lot of history <laughs> with me. <laughs> and uh, ain't nothing funny about uh, ain't nothing funny about these two. Um, because uh, anybody can see that William McCray has been bought and paid for. It's a whole bunch of stuff I could have pulled out, but you've seen the videos that he's made about Larry Reed, and you've seen the stuff that I've seen him, I played that he made about Larry Reed. But I'm gonna give you the backstory tonight. There was a time when I first discovered, I see out of all these people online, I've been clowning and doing whatever. William McCray is the only person I've ever met face to face. I met big William McCray, not the, the version you see now, not, not, not NK38 makeup and all that. I met him when he was big. And uh, anyway, so Larry Reed, <clears throat> William McCray, hold on, y'all. And uh, so y'all, y'all good. So Larry Reed, William McCray, and Jack was supposed to do this camera uh, show in Atlanta. And Larry was setting it all up. And they were all do it. And Larry, the reason he was partnering with them, because Larry didn't have a big problem. He didn't at the time. But Jazz and McCray did. And he needed their fan base to make the show successful. Now, I'm going to tell you something about William McCray. Before this Larry Reed stuff, <clears throat> William McCray was huge before his fall. He was huge. I'm talking about before this whole YouTube stuff. Even before YouTube, William McCray had over 300 plus thousand people following him before YouTube. He had something called Obnoxious TV. He had his own website. He had his own app. People were going to his app to read his blogs and watch his videos. He had a massive following. And he was massive because he was out here getting dirt on preachers and people that were enemies of Ebenard Joy. Oh, a lot of people didn't know that. The job that Larry Reed has now, talking about, oh, this is my mentor. William McCray had that job first. Oh, my, my, my. Some insight. On the history of Larry Reed and William McCray, okay, what led to the fallout? What had happened when? What's going on? And why conscious is so upset? Why conscious crying? Why conscious alleging that he and Larry are no longer together? Gathering close. Gather in close when Daryl Moore is fixing to tell us exactly what that were. Jordan would give him money to go get dirt on preachers that he didn't like. So Jordan kept his hands clean while McCray did all the dirty work. Kind of like Conscious TV with Larry Reed. And kind of like with Larry Reed with even our Jordan. You follow me? So, anywho, William McCray became a liability because of his lifestyle. You know, Rumors about you know all the lawsuits he got into that he lost, uh, the, the the gay allegations, the, the pink dildo video leak, the scubala on the walls in the hotel room, and all that kind of stuff. All that stuff just too much. So Larry, who's an opportunity, saw himself. This was his time to move up. William on the bus. So Ooh. Jordan had, uh, how do I know this? Because the person, one of the people that was there when it happened, Jordan had him on speaker and was laughing at how William was on the phone crying, begging him not to be fighting. And he took great joy in hearing William beg. And William lost everything. Ooh. Money, his place to stay. He was pillar to post. William vowed to get Larry back. He vowed to get Larry back. And it's, it's, it's very odd, you know, that, you know, that these two have found common ground okay i mean william isn't he hasn't recovered from everything that larry took from him so what is larry giving him that that that, that is making him okay with what they did he has never recovered from that so that was the bad blood right there that was bad blood between him <clears throat> and larry that was William's bad blood. But because William likes this here, Ooh. he was going to partner with Larry and Jive do the show. Well, Larry, after he got what he needed, 
he got rid of Jazz and William. He said, well, my sponsor don't feel it'd be a good idea for me to be doing this sh this event with two openly gay men. Mm -hmm. They find that hypocritical and ironic because he's gay. But we didn't know it at the time. But we, we had our, our we assume we, we had educated guests, but we didn't have the Vincent Hill video at the time. We didn't have the accusers at the time. We didn't have none of that. So that was the lie he was putting out. William McCray just went on away. He just went away. He was like, hey, what? no, Jazz went at Larry. <laughs> and then that's when J uh, Larry put Conscious TV on Jazz. And they, and my, my, my. you guys see the pattern? For years, Larry Reed has been pitting Conscious TV on this person or that person. You know, we're going to review Conscious response to all of the you know, uh, uh, to the HIV allegation. But in that response, you know, he alleges that, you know, for years, you know, he, he, he has sacrificed, you know, his integrity, his platform, his, you know, opportunities and, and, and you know, windmilling for Larry fighting the calls and you know every time that Larry has an opportunity to return the favor he drops the ball escalated him bragged about shutting his channels down and taking his source of income and all of that he had no clap back y'all remember remember that Yeah, he had a big pimple on his nose. I'm, 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 mm. Y'all need to start Googling some of these symptoms y'all see. Ooh. Lesions on the face and, and, and mm. <laughs> what y'all call them. Hey, pimples and all of stuff. Y'all need to start Googling and researching where this stuff comes from, people. So, anyway, I took some notes. I know that's right. So, during the video, something stuck out. Let us know if you remember in the chat. If you remember in the chat. Well, a lot of stuff, but this really stuck out. This really stuck out, ladies and gentlemen, to me. I don't know about y'all, but this stuck out to me. This stuck out to me. Y'all ready? <laughs> Breaking news. Y'all okay, ready? Period. This stuck out to me. And here it goes. No, um, I don't feel like, I feel like on the internet, when it comes to social media, what matters is the salaciousness of the story. And people just believe what they want to. Like there was some rumor that I had HIV. Then I just started 19. And then I was- Which how they've been saying, they've been saying I was gonna die in the next 15, 20 minutes. <laughs> right. Yeah. And look, and then, but this is what I did, uh, the blog of Conscious TV. Now, we do the Build Your Immune System Health and Wellness Challenge. So we always get- Well, blood. see, he do have it. So he does have it. Who you, who you talking about? Your, your, I don't wanna get into that. Your friend Conscious, he's- but, but don't. Uh oh, oh, yeah, oh, to my conscience, yeah. Okay, now I, I can't be involved. Hey, I'm, I'm a hush, yeah. I'm I'm a hush. forgive friend. me, forgive okay. me because I know I know that's your friend, right? Thank conscience, you, Jesus. Conscience, my friend is a great guy, so and I, okay, and all that he drugged me, baby, he drugged me for Phil. I heard, I don't think you heard me. I'm gonna play that two more times, and I want you to. Since you heard what William McCray said, the next time that I'm playing it, which is now, I want you to look at Larry Reed's facial expressions when he says. And here we go. One more, more, one more time for the girls in the back. One more time for the girls in the back. Remember to support the show. We can't do it without your support. We got cast up, super chat, Ben Moselle. We just crossed the two hour threshold win. We just crossed the two hour threshold win, which means that uh, as of right now, we on borrow time. Okay, on Pierre, keep the show going. Hop out of the bushes, support the show. Support the show. We got cash up, super chat, Venmo, Zell, crypto, however you want to do it. Let's keep the show going because we got a part three. There's another layer. We got a whole nother layer. We got a whole nother layer. Let's go. No, um, I don't feel like, I feel like on the internet, when it comes to social media, what matters is the salaciousness of the story and people just believe what they want to. Like there was some rumor that I had HIV. Then I just started 19. And then I was- Which how they've been saying, I, they've been saying I was going to die. Yes, cousin, 15, that's what minutes. I was talking about. <laughs> right. Yeah. That's what I was talking about. Then, but, but this is what I did. Thank you, fam. Uh, the blog, the conscious Thank TV. you, cousin. God, we do the Build Your Immune System Health and Wellness Challenge. So we always get- Well, blood. see, he do have it. See, he does have it. Who you, 
you talking about? Your, your, I don't want to get into that. Your friend conscious. He's a, but but don't. Uh oh. Oh yeah. Oh, it's about conscious. Yeah. I, I can't be involved. But in I, okay. hey, I'm a, I'm a hush. Yeah. I'm a hush. I'm a Forgive friend. me. Forgive okay. me because I know I know that's your friend. Right. At least he claimed him now because you know. All that he drugged me. He didn't claim him last year. Okay, he didn't claim conscious last year, so at least he claimed him now. I mean, that's an approved man. Maybe he drugged me for Phil. I heard. Ladies and gentlemen, y'all know me and Marcellus as friends, right? I, I look at Marcellus like a brother. If anybody says something like that about my friend, I'm going to defend my friend, right? Now, according to this video, he said, he's my friend. Why didn't you defend your friend? Why didn't you defend your friend? Huh? Because if you talk about Marcellus in my presence, I'm going to get you straight. Right then and there. You're not going to talk about my brother like that. Period. And Larry failed to respond. Larry didn't say anything, which is part of the reason Conscious was crying, um, you know, because he feels like a clown. He feels stupid. He feels used, uh, uh, you know. All these years, you know, he's been windmilling for Larry. Like someone said in the chat, he's done marathons, you know, victim shaming the accusers. And, and, and you know, he's done so much. And for Larry to allow, you know, this man who Larry also, you know, put conscious TV on this man also. You're going to allow this man that you had me dragging and, and, and beefing with to say that I got HIV? Like, what type of nigga is you? And you attack the main thing that you are. You attack homosexual men, openly gay men, who are comfortable in their own skin. William McCray is vehement. That so-and-so. I'm not even going to say the term to you because YouTube has rules. Very homophobic. And he just... No straight man wears acrylic nails. Ooh. No straight man... Uh, dresses and acts like him. Uh, dead people in the cemetery can see that both of you are gay men. It, it, it's, it's not rocket science. Both of you are closeted gay men. And you attack people that are comfortable in their own skin because you're jealous of them. You're gay. Extra crispy. Extra Ooh. crispy gay. My, my, my. Look up the word gay in the dictionary and two of y'all be like this. Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video right now. <laughs> Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video right now. When remember to support when okay on period. Remember to support. Yeah, super duper. Bells and whistles gay. Just just gay as you can be. You got them long finger there like you daddy grace. You gay. You, you talk about people that have had women that have had children out of uh, wedlock. You call the women whores. You call the kids bastards. Uh, everything that you were. I, think I, didn't, I forgot about your background. Your mother was a teenage mother who had you by a married man. So. My, my, my. They said Conscious TV cried. Somebody dropped the link. Please, friend, you missed it. You missed it. This all we got. This all we got. Okay, on period. I think somebody got the receipts though. I'm I'm waiting for a response. But this is what we got. We got screenshots. We in okay. <laughs> oh, lonely. I am so lonely. I have nobody to call my own. Conscious TV was crying, girl, because uh, according to William. McCray, he has the package, and Larry didn't defend him. Because uh, according, I mean, I guess Larry know what 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 conscious status he is. So maybe they've gone to the clinic together. Maybe they got the same doctor. I don't know. When you talk about calling these kids bastards and the women whores, you're talking about yourself. Talking about yourself. Mm hmm. Again, to watch this video in its entirety, make sure that you guys are checking out Daryl Moore's platform and subscribing to his show right here on YouTube. 
you talking about yourself, playboy. So I don't know where all this hatred comes from, but y'all need to seek therapy about that. Because both of y'all open. I mean, y'all ain't got no closet. Y'all got a plexiglass. Oh. Everybody's seeing to your closet. You don't have no door. You got plexiglass up there. <laughs> Thin plexiglass at that. Because y'all is extra crispy gay. Oh. So you attack these church people this gay. Because you know that's a death sentence in the black church. They'll forgive you for everything for being gay. That's, that's a, a career killer. How are you going to talk about somebody? Oh, and, and this Patreon, when you got a layer, got all this porn with these, these, these gospel artists and these preachers having sex. But, uh, yeah, it, it, your stuff coming out soon. It's videos of you. Ooh. It's coming out soon. Videos of you. It's going to come out real soon. And, uh, but yeah, moving on. My, 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 because you know that Lester is the legend that he's going to put out the OnlyFans videos of Larry. Well, not the OnlyFans videos, but the sex tapes of Larry and himself on OnlyFans. My, my, my. So Larry allegedly has some sex tapes coming out soon. I mean, I don't think anybody's interested in seeing those sex tapes. You know, uh, according to Lester, you know, Larry's a quick pumper. Like, you know, it's, it's, it's really not given. And then those pictures that Larry put up with, uh, in, in, in underwear, like, girl, don't nobody want to see that. Larry look old, frail, nasty, or... or he got craters all in the skin. Like he need to go uh, 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 seek help. Period, and not penis. Girl, stop spreading the package around. Stop spreading diseases. My my my. Y'all like this video? Like this video? Like this video? Remember to support, support this video, support this video. Hop out of the bushes and support. Okay, on period. We can't do it without your support. Okay, on period. And we can't stay here too much longer unless you guys uh, are supporting. Win. Okay, on period. The producers are trying to wrap the show. And I go for your king pain. You already know. Okay, on period. You already know. Okay, on period. Support the show. You support. Yeah. Yeah. Don't be weird. It's too lit over here. Uh, Larry said he's going to make a, a, a remake of Niggas Ain't On My Level video. Good. Go for it. got to give me something to make fun of and remix myself. Yep. Okay, don't nobody see none of that at all. At all, mm -hmm. friend. At all. So, all this talk. But I will make sure they get the record straight. I've never put your parents' information on the internet. And I've never done anything towards your children. Ooh. Ever. Don't accuse me of committing oh, a crime against right. children, ever. Because I've never committed a crime against children. That was truthful. I was accused of it one time. But I cleared my name. Sound like mm. let me stop. That's another story. <clears throat> See, William McCray, you seem to have forgotten. Y'all all friends again. You seem to have forgotten that CTV set you up to have court documents served on you mm. in the grocery store mm. in the fruit and produce section. Mm. And he recorded it live and was pop on a live podcast of you being served papers in the, in the grocery store. And he did it for your newfound friend. My, my, my. My, my, my. So you see, Larry has been having Conscious TV beefing with William. Larry is the reason that Conscious and William McRae are at odds. What would he look like all of a sudden out of nowhere going to sit with william after all that he did and furthermore what the fuck does larry look like larry you're not keeping your hoes happy okay and you know i think conscious tv is going to be speaking out soon he's going to be the next accuser coming forward okay mark my words okay and well 
I wouldn't even say accuser because at this point he's complicit. The uh, the next complicit party, okay, the next member of the inner circle to come forward. Yeah, that's gonna be constant TV. Yeah, he's not an accuser. He's no victim. He's no survivor. He's a complicit party. Let's talk about it. Cause y'all it fell out. Didn't know that did. Now one of the few times I've talked to Constance TV on the phone, we yeah. were still cordial. Cause I, I didn't like you then. Still don't. But um I let bygones be bygones, but I don't like you because you messy. You're a messy queen. I don't like that. I don't like bullies. That's why I don't like the two of you. But I strongly suggest the two of you never bother me. Cause I see to it that you getting put in handcuffs. And uh, you better not bother yeah. me. Cause you don't uh, my, my, my. Records have a way of showing up in, in places. My, my, my. My, my, my. He said, don't fuck with him. Okay, on period. My, my, my. He's advising Conscious TV to drive straight. Okay, on period. Because if we get to making googly eyes at him, he <laughs> If conscious get to making googly eyes at Daryl, he know where to leave the paper trail. Okay, he know where to drop that paperwork off at. Okay, over here, yes it did, yes it did. He said, "Don't think to seek any sort of employment." Okay, on period. Motherfucker thought he was gonna motherfucker or oh, oh, oh. have an opportunity at, at BET or on Fox or wherever. Dale Moore is making it clear that these people do not want to be affiliated with an alleged child molester. Okay? Your master is the reason you're not getting an opportunity. My, my, my. You guys like this video? Like this video? Like this video right now? Win. Like this video? Support this video? Win. We got Cash Up Super Chat Ben Mozilla. We're coming up on a, a, a third hour. Okay? A third hour, we're approaching our third layer win. You guys make sure that you guys are supporting the show. Keep the show going. Keep the show going. Keep the show going. We can't do it without your support. Hold on. The reason I keep making the announcements is because, you know, y'all keep ignoring the announcement. So I got to keep stopping and making sure that you guys are, are, are here. Making sure that you guys are here. Okay, if you guys are planning on supporting the show, let me see some trophies in the chat. Let me see some trophies in the chat. That way we acknowledge you. We like to acknowledge our supporters. We can't do it without your support win. We got a, a lot more show to go. If you guys got time today, okay? If you guys got time today, support the show. Support the show, okay, on period. We got another layer. Like I told you at the beginning of the show, the show is layered, okay, on period. We got another layer. We got another layer after this. After this. Okay, I'm here right now. We're on layer two. Okay. And we're talking about the fallout between Larry and William McRae. Yes, it did. Hey, Kitty, what's going on? Thank you, friend. Thank you for the support. Thank you, Hudson. Thank you for the support, Ava. Thank you for the support, Win. Yes, hop out of the bushes, okay? Just like Ava, Hudson, and Kitty and support the show. My, my, my. I hope Claudia was lying to him because, um, girl, la, 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 la. You know, Conscious TV is acting like he found this. He he has this newfound value because he's been working with Claudia Jordan behind the scenes. I doubt it. In mm him, -hmm, period. If Claudia wanted Claudia wanted to work with you, she would have put you on oh, 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 oh. flop soul, right? Now he's alleging that he's going to be working with Claudia Jordan and some other content creators on YouTube. Who are my like, bro? <laughs> the Armand I know put it in his contract. Okay, he don't want nothing to do with Flop Soul. If Flop Soul got anything to do with a conscious TV, okay, on period. Whatever, whatever uh, uh, Claudia told you, you should got it in writing with, okay, on period. Because now that Armand is <laughs> any chance of you working with Claudia that 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 didn't went out the window when okay on period girl I know that energy 
<laughs> I know that energy win. Okay, oh, period. He put that in his contract. I'm trying to told you, win, girl. <laughs> Claudia, this uh, slowly stop answering your calls and slowly stop stop returning your texts. Okay, I know that. I know that win. Yes, uh, thank you, friend. Yes, uh, shout out to resurrected work. When I asked you guys, to, oh, let's just be clear. Hold on, let me clear something up too because you guys are uh, creating some confusion in the chat. So when we ask for trophies to be dropped, if you've already been acknowledged, unless you plan on sending more support, don't drop another trophy. Because what you're doing, you're sending the signal to people that, hey, he's getting support. Why hasn't he moved on? The reason that I keep asking is because people are dropping trophies and not sending support. If you've already been acknowledged, you've 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 been acknowledged please don't drop a trophy if you've already been acknowledged unless you plan on supporting again if you're actually holding the show up there's people dropping trophies to support it at the beginning of the show when you go to work you get paid every hour you're at work right well i'm at work i expect to get paid every hour so if you supported two hours ago thank you I appreciate you. I acknowledge you the last hour and I appreciate you so much. But I got a business to run. I do. So every hour I'm here, I'm gonna be stopping, I'm gonna be asking for support. So when I when I'm when we're talking about dropping trophies, we're talking about people who are planning to hop out of the bushes and support, not the people who have already supported. Because what that, again, what that's going to do, somebody's going to say, hey, you know, that would support, they're going to say, well, hey, they already supporting, so, you know, he got it. They got it. And they don't because they already support it. So, yeah. My mic is muffled. Can everybody hear me? They say my mic is muffled. Is, am I muffled? Girl, please. You ain't got nothing, Claudia. Is my mic muffled? Yes, thank you for your services. All right, yeah, thank you. Okay, thank you, man. Thank you. Yes, thank you for your services. Okay, <laughs> thank you so much. We appreciate all the support from the bottom. Uh, uh, I appreciate all the supporters from the bottom of my heart. I, you know, I just wanted to bring some clarity, you know, to that because you know sometimes people hit me up like, "Oh, what that word?" or "Why?" You, that's because there's a little confusion. So hopefully, I cleared that up for some people. Okay, on period. So, yes, remember to support the show. We got Cash Up Super Chat, Vimo Zell. When I'm asking for trophies, I'm asking people to hop out of the bushes who are planning to support so that we can go ahead and move forward with the show. Okay? Not backwards. We're not going back to the beginning of the show and acknowledging all the people that we've already acknowledged. We're trying to acknowledge people who haven't supported yet, who are planning to support. Again, I hope that brought some clarity to some of you guys. Yes. Shout out to Plant Life LLC. Thank you, I know that's right. Back to the situation. Okay, on period. Right now, Daryl Moore is getting ready to get into how his beef with Larry Reed started. Okay, and Larry Reed's history with Bishop E. Dewey. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Shout out to everybody that dropped trophies when okay on period. I, I, I hope that you guys dropped trophies because you guys are planning to support. I love y'all. Thank you guys for loving on me like you do. We are having a, 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 a three-part show today when, okay, gathering close. Mm -hmm. Yep, it was right there in Kroger, in the grocery store. You got served court papers. Mm -hmm. But you failed to forget. Now y'all friends. How y'all? How you and him gonna be friends when he's friends with your enemy, and your enemy is friends with him, and y'all gonna come to head? I, you, you and Larry won't be friends by Memorial Day. Watch what I say, and I'm gonna explain why. Because as I move down the list, you may, Larry, you may veil threat on the on the little interview, the little podcast with McCray. You said you felt like. Uh, getting a white van Ooh, with no seats in I the know, back. That's right. And you and your people just snatching somebody up and beating the hell out of them and dumping them off somewhere, somewhere, someplace else. <clears throat> Let me address that. Claudia actually came over here too uh, one day and said, uh, "Now this is before she hired a, 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 a old girl." Um, 
but she said in my chat that she wanted to work with me too but girl i don't know she never uh, followed up i told her to email me she never followed up so that's what that word about it is what it is on okay, computer she got the right person for the gut job clearly god has other things for me better things okay yes it did much better you have a dream of reading anything reading an outhouse and thinking you're gonna do something to me snatch me up Oop. <laughs> if you even think about trying to snatch me up off any street anywhere this is a double o buckshot 12 gauge hold six buckshots in it. The equivalent of six nine millimeter bullets flying out at you. This ain't what you want. My, my, my. Because if any white man pull up, it won't be for me. It'll be the, the county coroner coming to pick up you and your crew if you try to snatch me up off the street. Because I ain't never empty hand. I sleep with my hands full. Just so you know. That's not a threat. That's just letting you know. Ohio is very different from Georgia. This is a Open carry state, very second amendment a friendly state, red state. Govern yourself accordingly. Hey, gathering close. How we roll. See, let me explain something to you. Don't threaten nobody that ain't scared. Because unless you and your crew can run faster than 3,162 feet per second, this ain't what you want. Google what travels at 3,162 feet per second. Google that. Say, what travels at 3,162 feet per second? That's as quick as you can blink your eye. Google that. Let's see. Let's see. What what travels? You know I'm messy. Travels at three thousand six hundred sixty-two miles a second. I think that's what he said. Yeah, I don't think it's that, yo. I think I got the number wrong. <laughs> I think I got. I want to. I want a copy of it too. I heard um, the baddest blogger has it. That's what I heard. I'm reach out to. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see if I got a response from the baddest blogger. I heard that he got it. Hold on. He, he be having everything. He be having everything. Let me see. Hey, from What? I thought I was following. Hey, friend. How have you been? Nobody knows me like you do. Nobody else wants me quite like you. <laughs> I don't know if anyone got it. I did ask my mom to record it, but I don't think they got it. Um, we're going to see. I'm asking. I just asked him right now. <laughs> okay. CCT, CCTV bundles from AliExpress travel faster than that, Daryl. Okay. On period. Get. <laughs> okay. That that mute, mutant go, will surprise you. Okay. On period. You fuck, <laughs> fuck around and sorry. One of them buckshots at that motherfucking conscious. That wig on motherfucking wrap around him and, and swoop him up and, uh, and take him away. Is that what that word? Y'all seen I Dream of Genie? <laughs> All that, that musty bitch gonna have to do is wiggle her nose, okay? I'm period. <laughs> oh. Oh, he, oh, he got part of it. Yay! He got part of it. 
Can you send it, please? Send it, please. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah! Girl, we got resources around this motherfucker. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play. We got the crying video. So, yo. I got about 30, 30 of them. Yeah, that's that Aaliyah swoop got powers. I'm talking. 30, <laughs> it's definitely the power in that Aaliyah swoop, okay? There's <laughs> definitely some motherfucking uh, superpowers in them stiff wigs. Yes, it is. Okay, he definitely right, uh, uh, then rub some motherfucking pixie dust and some motherfucking uh, hoodoo oil on that shit. Okay, up here, y'all got to y'all got to be wearing them still ass wigs that he be wearing. Uh, Matrilla York. It's a it's a short story, but I give you Cliff no person because you knew. Um, one of my friends years ago before I even thought about doing any of this said, "Hey, you got to check out this vlog. He's a messy queen, but he's funny." Da 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 da. Name Larry. So I started looking. Well, I said, "Okay, he's, he's comical in an offbeat kind of way. He got a you know interesting." So anyway, he he took a, a, a hush some hush money from from my frat brother who was a preacher named E. Dewey Smith. Um, ten thousand dollars to shut up and not talk because he had a baby out of wedlock, and in the non disclosure agreement that I posted online. It said if either side breached the agreement, they owed the other person two hundred fifty thousand dollars. So he decided to be slick and have CTV talking about the story, Ooh. and he stopped talking about it. But he had CTV Ooh. doing it, so he sued Larry for the two hundred fifty thousand dollars plus the ten. So he owed Larry. Larry owed him two hundred sixty thousand dollars. He got a default judgment because he had a shitty lawyer, Olga, who he blamed for him losing the lawsuit. And uh, so I asked him privately offline. I inboxed him. I said, "Hey, is it true that you took a bribe for ten thousand dollars? Because I got a copy of the document." Got Dr. E. Dewey Smith and they got Mr. Larry Reed on it. And it's notarized. So I asked him, he said, Who do you think you are? To ask me anything. I said, Okay, you're right. You don't owe me no explanation. And I left it at that. I was cool. I didn't care. Because you like it, I love it. But then the next day, he blows all my information up, put it on the screen on the thumbnail, and was clowning me for his whole show. Look at this person. Da, 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 da. I said, Oh, so this is how you want to play me? Okay, I got mm. time. So I started investigating everything about him his text, uh, his, his financial dealings, his, his nonprofit. I started investigating everything. That's how I came across those three accusers. Um, mm -hmm. They were sent, they approached me about telling their story on my show. And that's how it all started. Five years. So now you've heard how me and Larry's beef started. You've heard how Daryl Moore and Larry's beef started. You heard how Tasha K and Larry's beef started. And as a result, you've seen how Larry sends his lapdog conscious TV after people that he doesn't agree with. For years, conscious has been Larry Reed's minion. You know, whatever Larry needs, you know, conscious was, you know, happy to provide. You know, if he needed somebody to lie or co-sign some bullshit, you know, Conscious TV was just the clown to put on a show. He was willing to be Larry's stepping stool because Larry would in turn walk all over him. And, you know, today, Conscious TV is tired of it. He's tired of it. All that and more coming up in layer three. Oh, layer three is going to be explosive. Layer three is going to be explosive. I don't know if we're going to get to layer three. Y'all want layer three today? Y'all want layer three today? Okay, I'm here. If y'all want layer three, I need everybody hopping out of the bushes to support the show. Support the show. Support the show. We don't come here. We're going to be done. Been here three hours in a second. He will. And ever since then, food. I've been shedding nothing but light on them cockroaches. And when the Ooh. light come on, they scatter. But I, they, I they try to attack me with lies, and I attack them with truth. Mm. So that's what happened. But anyway, there was another threat made. Uh, that legal action is going to be taken. Let me just address that. And I'm going to be very, uh, you know, I've been having fun cutting up. Let me be very serious. I said this before, I'm going to say this one more time. 
That is your legal right, sir, to sue or take legal action if you feel you've been wrong. But if somebody's telling the truth on you, it's just the truth. And you have to take that L like a good soldier. Ooh. But here's the thing. If you take anybody, and the discussion has been had, if you take anybody to court, just know two things going to come in that courtroom with them. That audio of you admitting to Vincent Terrell Hill that you arranged the marriage between your cousin, Latrice, and Lester Pelter, the soccer player who, who said he was your lover for a year. You, on, in your own voice, admitted that you arranged the marriage. You gave Lee, uh, Latrice money to marry Lester so he could stay in the country. And as such, you committed a felony, sir. That's one thing. So let me refresh your memory about that. Let me refresh your memory about that crime, sir. See, um, hold on. It's right here. No, I took it off. Anyway, that marriage license. My, 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 we got it. We got it. Do, is the marriage license here? Ooh, I think I just took that out. Hold on, I got it here. Y'all like this video, like this video, like this video right now. <laughs> like this video right now. <laughs> Take that out of the back office, girl. We don't need that. We don't need that. <laughs> oh, y'all like this video, like this video, like this video right now. This marriage certificate right here. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. That marriage license, sir. That marriage license between your cousin and Lester is gonna come into court. The audio of you admitting that you arranged the marriage between Lester and your cousin coming into court. That's one thing. And just to refresh your memory. Ooh. That's what's gonna happen. Period. You're gonna be reported Period. to ICE. You already know how to uh, 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 boost me up, friend. Boost me up, friend. You already, <laughs> friend. You already know how to boost me up, friend. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Go to sit another You already know how to boost me up, friend. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Y'all want to continue the show? Okay, on period. Y'all want it to be extra lit? Okay, on period. And not crispy like them hoes over there. Y'all know what to do. How about other bushes support the show? Okay, I'm here. We can't do it without your support. Let's go. Your cousin gonna be reported to ICE. Lester's gonna be reported to ICE. Lester Ooh. probably he don't want to stay in the United States anyway. So the only thing they're gonna do is deport him. He don't want to stay in nowhere. He wants to leave. Bloody. So the two of you are gonna get arrested. <clears throat> the two of you are gonna get arrested, and this is the penalty. So you think I'm lying? Five years imprisonment and a two hundred and fifty thousand dollar fine. For knowingly entering into a marriage for the purpose of evading any provision of the immigration law under section they're not playing girl they're not playing he not playing with he not playing in eight of the u.s constitution okay so you're gonna say that again you face no. it so you sue somebody in civil court if you want to you're gonna be in criminal court you're not going to be facing just uh, a civil matter. You're facing a criminal matter. Five years in prison. Federal time. That means you're going to do the whole five years. You ain't going to do part of it. You're going to be gone for five years. And you're going to pay a quarter of a million dollars. Cash. If you don't have that quarter million dollars, you, they're going to seize your asset. You go right ahead. You sue somebody. That's what you're going to get. If you send a court document to anybody's house, that's what's waiting on you. You're going to be reported to ICE. And you're going to get arrested. And you're going to be facing five years in prison. Of 250,000. Joe said, Leave me the fuck alone because I'm not playing with you hoes. I'm not playing with you hoes. I'm not playing. He said, I got all the receipts. I'm not, I got all the receipts. I got everything I need. Okay, on period. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. My response to your, whatever lawsuit that come to this door would be a phone call to ISIS. Okay, follow up with uh, 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 all of the receipts. Period. And fine. And then your cousin gonna get arrested. She gonna face five years in prison and a two hundred fifty thousand dollar fine. And you go out here and windmill and talking tough to your supporters and getting them thinking you, you big bad Larry. They not gonna do a day of that five years in prison for you. Not one day. They ain't gonna put no money on your book. CTV is going to act like you don't exist no more because you ain't paying them because you're gonna be locked down. And all your bulk friends are gonna be gone. Ooh. You're gonna be on your own in that jail cell. Ooh. Five years fed time. 
end with the allegation on you that you know you mentioned that people say i got hiv and if that happens to be true you're gonna be locked down in a med unit in a federal prison man, man, man. that means you're gonna be in a cell by yourself you're not even gonna have a cell mate you're gonna be locked down 23 out of 24 by yourself for five years 60 months to the day no early release Ooh. and then the rest of your life you're gonna be a convicted felon and a lot of your rights that you think you enjoying now you're not gonna have no if you think of mine you better ask somebody that's, that's a convicted felon what their life is like and it ain't pleasant watch what i tell you now now you go out here and take somebody to court ice gonna be called and you're gonna face five years in prison two hundred fifty thousand dollar fine and then that's in court but you're gonna get arrested then you're gonna have to bond out then go to court and if you get convicted which you will because they got audio of you admitting that you committed the crime you are on audio admitting that you committed this felony so if you go to court with anybody there's audio proof of you admitting to the felony it's an open and shut case Ooh. you're going to go to federal prison for five years oh period that's the other side now that's the five years man I'm for larry oh it's larry fuck around and die on okay, on period girl i don't think that he gonna be able to get the necessary care in prison okay because his health is, you know, Conscious TV is going to tell us, okay, that his health is failing, okay, on period. Larry is frail and, and, and decrepit and stale, like, like you know, he needs to, you know, and that's part of the reason why Conscious was helping him with his, uh, 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 what he called it, uh, what kind of classes was they doing again? Nutrient class, what the what kind of classes was somebody help me help me please help me help me please what kind of classes was they doing again somebody said what's alarming is while everyone's exposing that man's sick behavior why is no one really fighting for the young boys he violated the sick behavior has turned into war of gay men it's sick you're absolutely right lolita uh those men those young men have to fight for themselves at, at some point they have to have the courage to stand up and, and fight for themselves they have to file their own lawsuits they have to file their own police reports they have to fight for themselves no one can do it for them unless you know like the feds come and pick it up but they have to fight for themselves um and that's that's really where the uh, uh, hold up is okay you know so many people want to tell their stories but you know they don't want to go through the headache or in the legal uh, process you know levantre was willing um he filed a police report um and he's still he's still willing you know to this day levantre is saying uh he's alleging that he has not been served we are going to review his lawsuit um after the show on coffee make sure that you guys are subscribed to coffee larry reed and levantre have a pending litigation larry reed is asking the judge to grant him a default judgment he just filed a new motion on february 26 less than a month ago um so yeah yeah official campaign has all other receipts make sure that you guys are on the coffee after the show on the coffee after the show okay on period like this video like this video like this video right now when like this video like this video like this video right now when remember to support the show okay on period we're coming up on the three hour mark okay on period Okay, sell to Plant Life LLC. I'm getting your messages, friend. I am. I don't know if you're sending a dollar to let me to make sure that it's me, but I am getting your messages in case you want to send more than a dollar. Um, I, no shade. I mean, I appreciate it, but I, I think you're sending me to send me a message. I'm not sure. I'm not sure because I, I see you sent your phone number on one, and then I, each one you send is like a little message. Okay, on period. You can email me too. I mean, you don't have to cash at me to send me a message. You can email me at theofficialcampaign at gmail.com. Okay, on period. But I am, I think the reason you were sending a dollar because you wanted me to confirm that I was receiving it. This this is your first time donating. Yes, I am receiving it. Okay. <laughs> I am receiving it just so you know. Um, 
but yeah like this video like this video like this video remember to support this video win okay on period yes where can i find the coffee show mods i'm fairly new here yes there's a lot of new people mods okay on period let's make sure that we're putting the links in the chat okay on period um can we get the link to the oh here go the link to the coffee it's right there friend it's right above you that's the link to the coffee show. We'll be on coffee directly after the show. King has been fighting for them and allowing them to tell their stories. The legal work is up to the victims. Absolutely. And I'm going to let that sit there for a second because that's exactly that's exactly oh, 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 what that word. Shout out to June J. Because that's just what that word. What that word. What June J said. King has been fighting for them and allowing them to tell their stories. I've been opening up my platform to the victims that's all i can do as far as the legal work they have to do that it didn't happen to me it happened to them it's not my experience it's theirs we may know these things to be true but in order for there to be charges or some sort of repercussions they have to they have to follow through they have to do the work my 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 i don't know what's going on in the chat but this is the home of the situation hopefully you guys can make up okay on period and come on back tomorrow or later on today and, and, and we can we can we family like a giant we fall back in the we fall back in. It's all love in the chat. It's all love. Period. It's all love. Okay, period. Now shake hands. Now hug each other. Okay, on period. Now hug it out. Okay, on period. We all family. Like a giant tree. Now hug it out. Criminal fact. You take somebody for it. They gonna subpoena your medical record. Hey, Minky Pinky, thank you for your support. Shout out to everybody supporting. Everything you tried to hide. So much. So everything you tried to hide. Continue to support the show. Continue to support the show. Oops. Oops. We got one more layer oh, left. Well, I'm not, I'm not. wrapping up. Well, so this is the wrap up to Daryl. Well, see, you're saying that you to tried to hide part, but this is actually a lot longer. I, it's like two and a half hours you guys can go check it out okay on period um but we're actually um wrapping up the part that i needed for this for this show okay on period my 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 so you know as you guys can see there are many many layers okay Larry Reed is a, a complicated guy. And you know everyone um, you know feels justified in their reaction because Larry has done some fuck shit to each and every one of us. Period. You get locked up in court. Is this the one? Yes, it is. Everything you try to hide about your medical history is going to become public record. Everything you tried to hide. Thank you, official King Payne. Everything that you tried to hide. Nah, nah, nah. My, my, my. In plant life, I will be giving you a call after the show. I will give you a call after the show as well. Okay? Yeah, so... Ooh, my, my, my. We need answers. We need answers. Dingleberry. We need answers. My, my, my. Lord. I've explained you. these lesions around your chest and you. arms and your mm -mm. on your forehead and temple and all in your scalp. All these lesions Ooh. that you've been hiding with Pancake 38 med me uh, makeup. You're going to have to explain the crater and the lesion. You're going to have to explain that in open court. Oh. So see, anybody that you sue, they're going to have you in open court and they're going to say, Mr. Reed. <laughs> Oh yeah, I got that audio sweet piece uh, when when William McCray was crying when that lawyer 
Well, somebody was suing him, he was begging him. William McCray was crying. You forgot about that. That's right. Guess who was playing that? Jive, CTV, all of them was playing it. But anyway, they're going to have you on the witness stand, uh, Larry. They're going to say, uh, Mr. Reed, are you HIV positive? Do you have any STDs, like herpes Ugh. or something? Ugh. And if you say no, Your Honor, i like to enter in the evidence, da 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 the medical records from there was a subpoena from Raleigh, North Carolina. Ooh. His medical records from Atlanta, Georgia. Ooh. Then it's gonna go, you're gonna get charged with perjury. Line of note. I'm just saying, if that's the case, because the rumors out there that you are, according to your former lover, he said he saw your HIV medicine when he was at your house, because he knows what it looks like. And he said he he said it on Tasha Cage show. I didn't. He did. He said he saw your HIV medicine. That's what he said. Yeah. So you're going to a court. It is a, that burden of proof is on you. Once they ask you, are you HIV positive? Do you have herpes? And you and you lie on the oath. You get charged with perjury. Each oh. count of lying on the oath, perjury, you're in jail, five thousand dollar fine. My my my, Larry, we need answers. Remember that now. So, like I said, you are free to go into court. Free country. You can sue. You can sue a ham sandwich if you want to, but. The person that you're suing has a right to defend themselves with a vigorous defense. And part of that vigorous defense is turning you into immigration for committing a felony, which is a crime, a yeah, criminal man. act, and they're going to subpoena your medical record. They're going to have it in open court. So your medical history is going to be public. I don't know forever. why they be thinking Daryl is playing. <laughs> Daryl is not playing with these hoes. My, my, my. Whoa. You got it. Is this it? Oh, shit. It won't just open. Let me see. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Yikes. <laughs> well, I get the video. I haven't got the video yet. I'm going to put it together. It's it to you because I ain't get the video yet. He ain't sent it yet. Let me see. He ain't sent it yet. My, my, my. He said he's going to put it out on Monday. So maybe he's trying to wait till he put it out. I don't know. Oh man. <laughs> oh, like this video, like this video, like this video. Let's go. They're going to play Vincent Hill's interview where he admitted to being your lover for 13 years. Not 13 days, not 13 weeks, not 13 months, 13 years. What's 13 times 12, real quick in my head? I can't Ooh. think of it. But multiply, somebody multiply 13 times 12 and put it in check. Tell me what that is. Mm -mm. 52 weeks in a year I'll tell you about 52 weeks in a year multiply 52 times 13 and tell me what that is 52 times 13 mm -hmm. put in the chat we're on the phone okay on the low end 13 times 12 is 156 but what's what's 52 times 13 welcome chosen one uh 52 times 13 okay so anywhere between 156 times and 676 times might be more than that. He said for 13 years, y'all were in a sexually active relationship. So if y'all just had sex once a month for 13 mm. years, you had sex 156 times. Damn! You had sex once a week. Ugh. You had sex 676 times. But if you were having sex multiple times during that week, it goes into the thousand. My, my, my. Larry! I, I know you, you don't you, you don't identify as a gay man. I know you don't like to identify, but I mean, I, you having that much gay sex? I mean, you gay? Period. I I hope I get the crime video so we can react to it. I you know I didn't get a response, so hopefully I get a response soon. You get me? So your medical record's gonna come into play. The three accusers are going to come into play. And the video of Vincent Terrell Hill admitting that he was your lover while you were married, Reverend, is going to come into play. So all the stuff you tried to hide, all the stuff that you normally did to other people, is now going to be done to you, but it's going to be done to you in a court of law, and it's going to be public record forever. Just saying. Do what you do. Man, man, man. Do what you do, though. But you let you let CTV put a battery in your back. Yes. Oh, we going to court. We doing this. We doing that. <laughs> 
tell you something. You've been his trick for many, many years. My, my, my. Because he, he got a big mouth. Yeah, I'm dealing with this preacher in Atlanta. You know, he pays my bills and gives me money from time to time. Da, 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 da. I text messages. That's that what he, he said. Mm. Better keep your hoes happy because if they get mad with you, oh, they're going to tell on you. My, my, my. My, my, my. My, my, my. What he said? You better keep your hoes happy. Because if they get mad, they gonna tell on you. They gonna tell on you. They gonna tell on you. And that's exactly what that were. My, my, my. We just crossed the three-hour threshold win. Okay? And it is time for layer three. My, my, my. Everybody has sex layer three. Layer three. My, my, my. My, my, my. Oh, we went over a lot of things in layer two. We went over a lot of things in layer two. Okay, on period. Daryl Moore and Larry Reed and how their beef began. We went over Larry Reed's lawsuit with Bishop E. Dewey. We also went over his friendship with William McCray and why Conscious TV feels a way. In layer three, we're going to go over, you know, what that word, okay? Conscious TV is crying. Why is Conscious TV is crying? Why is Conscious TV crying? What did he, what What was said, okay? Who said what? What's going on? Leave it to the official King Payne to bring some clarity to a dusty situation. Girl. Girl. Yes, it gets better than this. Conscious TV is admitting that his relationship with Larry Reed has been, you know, transactional. He and Larry have been in a sugar daddy, sugar baby relationship. And, you know, it's unfortunate, but it has come to an end. Like I said, you know, he's ready to work a regular nine to five. Okay, period. Period. He's ready to work a regular nine to five. If Larry won't, Larry don't want to respect him. Larry not going to. Uh, uh, Larry doesn't see his value. Then you know he he he'll, he'll go get it out the mud. Okay, on period. Okay, his pride and his self respect it's it's worth more than any or, or gift that Larry could drop off at his house. That's what he said. That's what he said. Official King Pan got all the receipts. Official King Pan got all of the receipts. Gathering close, gathering close. Win. Yes, he did. This is layer three. Everybody hashtag layer three. Everybody hashtag layer three. I wait. Everybody hashtag layer three. Everybody hashtag layer three. Okay, on period. Yeah, sir. Everybody hashtag layer three. Everybody hashtag layer three. And this is what we're gonna do for layer three. We're gonna make it very easy for the girls to support. We've been here three hours. This is the third and final segment. Okay, on period. We're going to ask everybody to send three dollars, three dollars to support and keep the show going. Yes, it did. If you can support, if you can support, I want to see you dropping trophies in the chat. Okay, if you can send three dollars to keep the show going, I want to see you dropping a trophy in the chat for layer three. We've been here three hours. Okay, we need at least another hour for this final layer okay on period oh and again we're gonna go over larry reed and conscious tv's fallout okay um conscious says ain't gonna be no making up okay on period he said that larry was over there trying to defend himself against the truth okay and you know he pretty much confirmed that larry reed does have hiv you know larry allowed william to say that he has hiv and, and according to conscious tv you know you trying to defend your truth by saying that it's a lie but it's the truth and all the while you allowed this man to put your truth to project your truth on me like what the fuck so he said hey, ain't gonna be no making up okay on period um he said if anybody sees him making up okay just know um 
that there was a change. He said he's not going back unless there's a change. I mean, you know, and maybe he wants some change, okay, on period. You know, maybe you need a bigger payout. Okay, maybe you need a raise. Is that what they were? Um, he said there will not be an us, i.e. him and Larry. Okay, they will. the relationship will not be able to move forward if um, there is no change. Okay? Um, he says that Larry doesn't have no authority over him. Okay, on period. And um, Larry needs to apologize publicly. Okay? Just like uh, 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 the infraction, okay, it was public. You know what what William said about him? It was public, and what Larry did it was public. So he needs to apologize publicly. Don't be calling my phone trying to apologize to me behind the scenes trying to give me a gift or something. Fuck that. He said Larry is demonic. He said Larry is a demonic, frail weirdo. Oh, I said now the girls want to call him demonic. Okay, now Larry demonic. Is that what that was? Now he's a demon, girl. <laughs> We already know he was over there uh, 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 worshiping demons, okay, on period. Yes, he did. We already know that when, okay, on period, ain't nothing holy about anything that he over there doing. He said, he went on to say that he's tired of seeing fucked up ass people in power. He said, I'm sick of it. I'm over it. I'm done with this shit. He said, you know, him and Claudia Jordan have been working on some stuff together, you know, so, you know, he's really feeling himself. Um, he said, him and Claudia Jordan are working on some stuff with some other content creators on uh, some other YouTubers, okay? Um, and he don't want to be a sugar baby no more. He said he don't want to be a sugar baby no more. He said if Larry doesn't see his value, um, he doesn't have time, okay? Um, he's found a new camel to milk, okay? So I guess, you know, he's, uh, uh, you know, focusing his attentions on, on Claudia and getting in good with Claudia, kind of like how he was you know, kissing Tasha K's ass at one point. But, you know, now he doesn't have Larry Reed to mess up that relationship. Is that what that word? Um, he said, it's been a very interesting ride being a sugar baby. And, all, and, and just so you guys know, he wants everybody to know that all sugar babies are not the same. Okay, on period. He says some sugar babies are the fuck and then some sugar babies don't. Okay, on period. I, I don't know what, what, what the inference is, it, what is supposed to be because we all know he's busting that shit wide and dropping it low for Larry, like whenever the fuck you get through, okay? You know that you, you, you was taking the pasapine and your flat back, okay, on period. Let's talk about it. You know, uh, uh, and like Tasha K said uh, uh, about Eddie Long, like you didn't have no problem when you were spending the money. Okay, these girls like to spend the money, okay, on period, and then you know, they like to spend the money, they like to, you know, receive the benefits, and then whenever the money is dries up and uh, 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 the benefits stop, they all of a sudden they feel away, they feel away, okay. Clear, I, that's what I said, that ain't never gonna happen because I'm hard gonna be all in Claudia ear, like, girl, no. The girl with the green wig, bitch, please. Okay, on period. You know he put that in his contract. Um, he admits he was a sugar baby. Yes. Oh my god, I'm about to play it right now. I'm about to play it right now. So welcome. Um, what is King Payne's cash app? Yes. Uh, um, they're asking for the cash app in the chat. Can we get the girls the cash app? Can we get the girls the cash app win? Okay, on period. Everybody hashtag layer three. Everybody hashtag. Layer three win, okay, on period. If you guys can send three dollars, three dollars for layer three, okay, on period. Three dollars for layer three. Go ahead and hop out of the bushes, okay. Send three dollars, okay, on period. Yeah, send three dollars. It's up and it's stuck here in the home of the situation. We're asking everybody to send three dollars to keep the show going. We've been here three hours. Oh, and we will be on the coffee directly after the show. We will be on the coffee directly after the show. When? Okay. Oh. My, my, my. So Conscious TV was crying. Okay. Uh, we waiting on the video. We waiting on the video. When? Okay. On period. Um, all I know is that North Carolina Beat has it. Um, he said he's putting it out on Monday. So I don't know if uh, you know I might I may get it before then or I may not. 
again i'm just waiting on a response yes it did um, yeah so um let's go over what was said what was said when and then i got some timestamps from consciousness video and we'll, we'll we'll listen to consciousness response to larry reed and william mccray okay so let's go um over what was said i think it's very important that we go over what was said okay One more time for the girls in the back. Okay, on period. Here's what was said. Everything being shown to you guys during this video is being shown to you guys underneath the fair use and copyright doctrine. Um, vindicate you uh, somewhat. No, um, I don't feel like, I feel like on the internet, when it comes to social media, what matters is the salaciousness of the story and people just believe what they want to. Like there was some rumor that I had HIV. Now that started in 19. And that I was well, child, they've been up. saying they've been saying I was gonna die in the next 15, 20 minutes. <laughs> right. Yeah. And look, and that but well, this is what I did. Um, the blog of Conscious TV. Mm. God, we do the build your immune system health and wellness challenge. So we always oh, well, see, he build your have, immune system. See, That's what have. they was doing. What are you talking about? They was doing that build your immune system challenge, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, what happened? Oh. So, like, there was some rumor that I had HIV. I right. So, so again, Conscious TV said on. that Larry Reed was over there trying to defend his truth with a lie. Why? Why I keep muting? Why I keep muting? Being weird. Why I keep muting? Like that. It's two to three minutes. It's not really that right that long. Like you know. right. But, Do you? Um, and this this is us talking. Mm -hmm. Do d does having done this? Do you feel vindicated? That part. Or Build do you feel that system. it will what they in about? some kind of way um, vindicate you uh, somewhat? Mm -hmm. No, um, I don't feel like I feel like on the internet when it comes to social media, what matters is the salaciousness of the story, and people just believe what they want to. Like there was some rumor that I had HIV, and I just started in nineteen, and that I was. Well, child, they've been saying they've been saying I was gonna die in the next 15, 20 minutes. <laughs> right. Yeah. And look, and that, but, but this is what I did. Um, the blog, the Conscious TV. God, we do the Build Your Immune System Health and Wellness Challenge, so we always get not. Well, blood. see, he do have it. See, he does have it. Who, Yo, yo. What is this build your immune system health and wellness challenge? I ain't never heard no shit like that. Take your vitamin C. Eat some oranges. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's my conscience? Yeah. Okay, now. I, I can't be involved. But I, okay. Find a way that I had HIV. Now, that started 19. And that I was... Which I, they been I... Saying... I'm sorry, it's being weird. Or do you feel that it will, in some kind of way, um, vindicate you uh, somewhat? No, um, I don't feel like... I feel like on the internet, when it comes to social media, what matters is the salaciousness of the story. and People just believe what they want to. Like, there was some rumor that I had HIV. Now, that started 19. And that I was... Which I, they been saying... They've been saying I was gonna die in the next 15, 20 minutes. <laughs> right. Yeah. And look, and that, but, but this is what I did. Um, the blog of Conscious TV. God, we do the Build Your Immune System Health and Wellness Challenge. So we always get not. Well, blood. see, he do have it. Ooh. He does have it. Ooh. What are you talking about? Your, your, I don't want to get into that. Your friend Conscious. Oh. He's a, but, but no, I don't want to get into that. Why not? Yeah. I, I can't be involved but in I'll, conversation. Okay. Hey, I'm a, I'm a hush. Yeah. I'm, I'm a hush. Forgive friend. me. Forgive okay. me because I know, I know that's your friend. 
right. And Kid Keith. Gotcha. My friend is a great guy. So, and I, and he, all that he drugged me, baby, he drugged me for Phil. I heard about it. I heard about it. But we want friends then. Right. Me, me, right we you heard out. about it or you told them to do it? So I, I had I, that, I, I had that wide brim, green and uh, navy blue and, and white hat on cocked to the side when we fell out. See, I, I, what is that boy? That's a boy on, uh, William McCray lip right up under his nose. Y'all see that? Fat ass boy. Ugh. Oh my goodness. Turn the camera off. Why does it keep muting? Yeah. I'm I'm a a Forgive friend. me. Forgive okay. me because I know I know that's your friend. Right. Gotcha. 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 My friend is a great guy. So and I and he All that he drugged me. Baby, he drugged me for Phil. I heard about it. I heard about it. But we want friends then. Right. Because we had fell out. Right. We had so, fell out real good. Yeah. So I, I had I, that I, I had that wide brim green and uh navy blue and, and white hat on cocked to the side when we fell out. See, I re I remember everything I had on and when we went in. Yeah. But no. Yeah. But we had we were you know what you all that are listening, all joking aside. Uh, this gentleman was um, a very, uh, a very good friend. Uh, gave me a a number of pointers. Um, told me, told me, yes, and friend. Me. Wig TV, Wig TV, Wig TV is who they're talking about. So now they're getting ready to get into their relationship. Okay, on period. Larry and William McCray's relationship, their history, um, what that were. Um, and I feel like this part, you know, after him saying that Conscious has HIV, this part really, really, really just like, uh, 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 you know, like added salt to the wound because they will begin to reminisce on how good, you know, their relationship used to be in. It was before conscious, and he, Larry was saying that you know he was praising, he was pretty much praising um, William, and I, you know, I'm sure this made conscious feel some type of way. Yeah, yeah, probably what most likely encouraged his tears. Oh, keeps doing this new thing. And Sorry, you know, for that, Larry, I will always. Uh, you know, forever be in, indebted and grateful to you for uh, for that. Well, I, I, when we met, we hit it off. We Ooh. laughed so much. It was crazy. Consistent <laughs> laughter. Consistent. And, and then, so, Larry, it was like... Love at first sight. Butterflies, puppy love, my, 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 they reminiscing, they reminiscing here, mm-hmm, wasn't nothing like it, huh, Larry? Each other all it our was. lives. It, it, it was much. It was crazy. Consistent laughter consistent and, then, and so Larry it was like when we met it was like we knew each other all it our was. lives <gasps> it, it, really it was, was just like where have you been all my life 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 Girl, <laughs> girl, this thing is fucking with me. That's no lie. You know, doing this, and you know, for that, Larry, I will always. Uh, you know, forever be in indebted and grateful to you 
for uh, for that? Well, I, I when we met, we hit it off. We laughed so much. And it was crazy. Consistent laughter. Consistent. And, and then, so, and Larry, it was like when we met, it was like we knew each other all it our was. lives. It, it, really it was, was just like it was yeah it was it, it was really incredible that's no lie so all of the help and whatever it was just because i liked you and we it oh. wasn't for the social media oh, we tell the truth larry you said all of the help was because i liked you tell the truth you ain't had no business liking on william let's tell it let's tell it we're gonna tell it tell it all Okay, on period, you know what kind of like you talking about when okay on period. Yes, it is. And the way that y'all talking about your like, it's, it's, it's starting to sound like y'all was in lure. Okay, on period. But that that's just me, okay, on period. What are your thoughts? Y'all let me know in the chat. Was these hoes in love or what? Girl. When we met, it was like we knew each other all it our was. lives. It, it, was, really, it was just like it was yeah it, it, it was incredible that's no lie so all incredible. of the whatever it was just because i liked you and we it wasn't Ooh. for the social media we weren't even on social media together it was just just a normal regular two church boys that love the church two gay church boys y'all just a regular degular gay church relationship with two 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 men right all right, and got sense of humor, and that's what it was, you know. So, um, yeah, I, yeah. I'm, and even with you dragging me, William, when I would get clipped, I would be that. Am I lying, yeah. Kendall? Uh -uh, I would say this Who? man is hilarious, and I would be laughing. I couldn't what? even get mad, so I would, huh? I'm opening the door. Who, T Mac, I'm opening the door. I'm fucked up, scared the shit out of me. All right, man. Don't come into my room looking all crazy. Yeah. All right. Clap back or throw off because it was hilarious to me. It, <laughs> I, I, I accepted it. it. I heard what you said. The commentary that matter if it was right or wrong, I just laughed. But to answer what you said earlier, I don't feel vindication. To me, it's social media is not serious. It has not affected my bottom line. It has not harmed my life. It has helped my life. It has helped prune some people out. You know, you got people who are fans. Right. Who really, really, uh, uh, the people that really, really love you, people that hate you, then people on the fence. Right. Really the people on the fence that I was looking at, wondering who they were, it let me see who was what. You know, so it's all. A gift to me. I don't feel like I need to respond to any of it in social media. What I have responded to and will continue to respond, respond to is legally. But I, and I'm not going to trash people that have talked about me that I've had any level of relationship with. Whatever they want to say is fine by me. Mm -hmm. Just leave it right around me alone. Lie or tell your truth or your. So you know, uh, uh, I think you know, Larry is catching wind to, you know. Daryl Moore and you know the things that he's saying and he's like you know just you know leave my leave my uh, uh people alone you know you could talk about me but don't talk about anyone else you know or don't mess with anyone else you know because you know a lot of people can get in trouble behind the fraudulent marriage you know you know they're all adults in the situation so there's not one person in particular um to place the blame so not only will Lester get in trouble, but Larry and his cousin is also going to get in trouble um, if ICE is brought into the fraudulent marriage situation. Everybody alone. And um, that's that's how I feel about that. I don't need to be vindicated. My work speaks for me. I mean, all these people that's doing what they're doing, people don't know well that we behind the scenes keep pastors out of jail. <laughs> 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 Uh, let, let, look, let's let's be clear. <laughs> yeah, they don't even know. I mean, they look at the stories we do tell, but that's I mean, that's we tell those stories and we make y'all laugh and y'all find out what's going on. But if that's we all the work we we call what we really know, yeah, Ooh. yeah, that's the truth, and we don't even always tell that. 
you know, so my work. And then on my platform, I listen. If we tell what we really know, for children, for single moms, for first ladies, they've been forgotten about. I mean, just the lady that Kim Burrell and bears a race of ten thousand dollars. You know, so it's just like oh, but it's not like, like that. She she told us she's out singing along, right? Exactly. <laughs> I'm singing a solo. Let that ass work for you. And so, <laughs> I, I, and so I, like this video, like this video, like this video right now, like this video right now. Kill. I, I just love it. She hateful. Yes, she is, but it's funny. It's like an old church. It mama. is. It like is. Mama. But yeah, she, but she yeah, so, is a good sanctified mother. Yeah, that's what that's that's what that's what uh, that, I mean, and that's just what I get from her. Yeah. You know, because uh, that's what I asked Mother Betty Ann Pace. I said, "Girl, when did you start being nice?" <laughs> She hollered. Her and Leslie hollered. I said, I said, everybody talking about how sweet you are. I said, you, <laughs> Mother, uh, Mother West, and um, Mother, uh, Mother, I Joe. Those are them three sisters, baby. Them three, Murphy's mama uh, and his two aunties. Well, see, I want here when powerhouses. Oh, baby. Them three mothers, they didn't like nothing and didn't like nobody. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, she said, sit down and get saved. Yeah. Get the Somebody said, spirit I, out of you. I'm going to call that. <laughs> when Murphy gave every single thing that they said, Larry Reed did, ask them for proof. That's all you got. Y'all just believe stuff because you don't like me, you jealous of me, envious, or maybe I'm just, I, we're, we're different kind of people. We're not your regular quintessential black men. We no. A little eccentric, a little extra, you know, so hey, fine. But, but Absolutely. Ask, or ask people for proof like y'all do us when we're telling a story. Yes. I mean, you, make people show you proof. Show me the children. Like the like the receipts that you showed uh, 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 on TD Jakes. Like the proof you provided when you when you alleged that TD Jakes um, sexually assaulted and molested young men. Like that? Boys that I molested. Find them. Find, find them. Find, find three boys. Bring them the, to me. Minors. <laughs> and tell them to come. And bring my what people. Jesus say. Bring Jesus said, bring my accusers to me. Is that, that's what I'm saying. Or tell them to go to the court and right. fight if if that is the truth. That that is just just how that go. Simple as that. I mean, that I don't know why y'all just don't. I mean, cause y'all don't let me get away with that. But y'all let folks just tell stories because it it sounds right because they knew me. That's their story and it's what they want to tell. I would never tell anything opposite of that not because what they saying is the truth right. but just because like William said I'm going to give power I'm going to give recognition to it adding my voice to that I don't want to do that I've already done that before and made a mistake in doing that because it blew stuff up exactly. I'm never never going to I'm not going to do that so me putting out this song basically is like this one I'm gonna give y'all. I'm not even answering back what y'all say. I'm talking about how y'all telling your stories for clicks and views using my name. That's right. that's basically what's gonna be, and you ain't on my level. Goodbye. Goodbye. That's it. You know, so I'm not even addressing that. I'm so Larry's supposed to be putting uh, 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 putting out a song. You ain't on my level, and uh, niggas ain't talking about nothing. Something like that, girl. Please, girl. Please, who's streaming Larry's single? I think it's uh he's doing R and B rap something but rap he's rapping now Lord going to address it except for the crime part I'm not <clears> using <throat> church um, money and I ain't molesting no boys them too and and, and, I, and, and don't I, ever I, don't ever come down from your pale white horse yeah don't 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 ever you know don't allow uh, people. And and trash. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, knew uh, what it was gonna be. Make you feel as if you, you know that you that you've got to uh, give them some level of platform. 
because it, 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 they're they're not even worth. They're not they're not even you know it it it, it it's in no kind of way uh, worthy of you and for you to even um, for you to even uh, address it. So now, what do you think after it's released? Um, they're probably going to be saying something. They're, it's going to make them stir up and start back again. But you know, I don't mind that, Will, because it, it's been so many years. Just spell my name right. I don't really care. The truth is the truth. I don't really right. care. The truth is right. the truth. Just, just, you know, let's just be clear. Mm. Let's, let's, uh, let's be clear. Well, I'm excited. I'm glad that, um, I'm glad that we have had a chance to talk. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah. And uh, you oh, know. hold on, let me, let me answer this when somebody says, So, are you gay? So, what now? So, are, it's the same person. So, this, this, I used to answer that question and tell too much of my business, right? But this is what I say to this now if you are interested in having sex with me, Ooh. it's none of your business. I, mean, I, I don't understand that. What? Why are you interested in how somebody like the bust a nut? If you, if I'm, in, it's absolutely my business. If I'm interested, I mean, what? It's not your business unless you plan on having sex. It, it, it is my business. It is my business. What are you talking about? If we plan on a, a, a sexual sex, if we if we talking about sex, then yeah, I need to know your orientation. Absolutely, I need to know who you sticking your dick in. Okay, and if you got any diseases, absolutely. What are you talking about? Weirdo. Lord, have mercy, Father. <laughs> this is what I say to this now. If you are interested. A hot ass mess. And man. having sex with me, it's none of your business. Who? I, mean, I, I don't understand that. Why are you interested in how somebody like to bust a nut if you're not trying to make them bust? Who Larry? Lord, have mercy for all time. <laughs> <laughs> but no, no, but that 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 is the honest to God. The, that's the honest to God. What? <laughs> Oh, man, mercy. Lord have mercy, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, but you know that—that's the truth. Like some man of God, my my my, I'll be just disgusted if this was my pastor. I. Well, you is crazy. Why are we interested? Oh my God! <laughs> you know why? Why are? Why are we interested in what you do Real. now? Underneath your we, clothes. We'll say that again. Oh my God, you are correct. Oh Lord, have mercy, <laughs> Father of oh God. <laughs> see, I can't take it. I can't. See, I can't take it. I can't. I. I. I can't take talking uh, about pulling these drawers down over the pulpit. I can't. Oh Lord, have mercy. Boy, you are oh. correct. Oh, oh my God! I gotta keep it holy. Thank you, Jesus. But no, I um, I I, I totally get it. I oh, no. um, I, I I I hear the um, you know, the passion, and I uh, I really understand. I really understand. I why. understand. Let me ask you this, because this was one of the things that I was most concerned about. Ooh. Um, when I would hear these malicious and vicious attacks, I, I, my heart immediately would go out to your girls. Yeah. yeah. My, my heart we go out to your daughters. Yeah. Um, and I would, um, (laughs) 
Shout out to I'm everybody here. But... Shout out to everybody watching. Make sure that you guys are subscribed to the show. Subscribe to the show. Subscribe to the show. It don't cost you a thing to subscribe. It, 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 William play way too much. <laughs> way too much to it. Okay, up here. I feel sorry for your daughters. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. I mean, because you know, they're just the beard. He didn't he they he didn't he don't <laughs> They're just the beard. I mean it, it you know. Oh, it's a mess. It's a mess. Okay, on period. Now he feels sorry for his daughters. Very transparent and honest with you. It's some aspects of covering the Eddie Long story mm. that, that in hindsight and after his death, that I really, I wish I had refrained. Mm -hmm. I wish, wish that um, I, 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 you know, tell it, but maybe tell it in a different way. Um, maybe I've had more compassion um, because the people didn't know um, about the, the his kids, mm -hmm. you know, getting put out of school. Having fights, having later. It, but see, well, that's the reason why I changed. How I, I I started changing in 2019 because I started meeting the people that were affected by whatever this pastor did. Aside from the the victim, what we call y'all like this video, like this video, like this video, girl. They look a mess. They look a mess. We don't care. Oh, they look like they're ready to go. Okay, ready for death. Okay, <laughs> girl. And that's what made me start curbing it. And I leaned more into my funny. And then I made it to where if it ain't public, I ain't gonna talk about it because I just didn't want to hurt people while trying to help and entertain people. Yeah. So you right, you do exactly right. I mean, and my girls think. Thank the Lord that they've been a part of a first family their entire life. So they're used to dealing with church people. Right. Um, that one of the um, people that was online talking about stuff, they know very well. And so they okay. were very hurt by that. <clears throat> and, and and so it's... it's Who, Vincent? I hate how they be trying to talk in code like we stupid. Just say the fucking name. Like, girl, we know everything. We know everything. We know everything. A lot. You got. To, I had churches in overseas and stuff. They don't. They don't been through a lot. Right. Um. Of course, they've been in therapy for. Oh my god! It just stopped, but it was in it for like three years. You know. So um. And a lot of the stuff that that was said online are rumors that started. It started in nineteen. But these rumors come, they go all the way back to 2009. So my children have been very familiar with it. And we talk open and honest with our children. So they're really strong. That's good. Uh, but I, I did think about, I wonder if anybody even thought about my daughters, you know. And it's good to hear that people thought about I, I really. Do I, you think I, about your daughter I, when you're doing um, that fuck shit? <laughs> I, I, I've thought about them. I thought about, you know, that it was, it was being put out what school they went to. I just, I thought about all aspects of those things. I really, I really, really did. I said, Lord, heaven forbid. White band or you hall band, they got no seats in the back. We all sit back there. Find them, drag them in and beat them, drop them off. And, and nobody knows what happened. A time. Oh, that's Tiffany in there. Yes, they did going to react it was just you know um never on mad day i didn't i ain't tell nothing that we talked about in private never I, never I, never, I, never disclosed 
You didn't either. No, Ooh. never disclosed any of our personal information, Ooh. none of our business. Man, man, man. Um, he done Ooh. five. That makes me okay. I'm not familiar with you no more. So whatever I said or didn't say to anybody will get back to him, and they say he said da da da, and then William will, will react. I mean, for y'all know what William is sensible. You know. <laughs> No man, because I'm gonna be the one to bring it to you if you mess with my man. That, I don't yeah, only so my that's own. How it happened. That more time went, went by and more distance, and that, that's basically what happened. That was it. So but I never came man. out and said, I did this, I did that, he did this, he said this. I never on Mad Day, I didn't, I ain't tell nothing that we talked about in private. Never, I, never, that, never did you didn't either. You didn't either. No. Never disclose any of our personal information, none of our business. Um, you know, we 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 just didn't agree, and you know, we we just moved on. But I am. It's complete. I am ecstatic. It's over. It's, it's over. Over. I mean, what kind of what what kind of personal info do they? What, if your friends, you, I mean, uh, colleagues, or something, like what? Y'all got to be talking about some nefarious shit, some freaky shit. Like, the girls is not dumb, okay? It's not too hard to read between these lines, okay? What do y'all think they was doing? Let me know it in the chat. It's the fact. And I'm ecstatic about this new chapter. Oh, I really new chapter. But, but, but conscious. We cannot discuss you know who. Because conscious. That's that was y'all. That was y'all running. Who? But conscious. But conscious. It was. It was. It was it's, it, everything is. Is. Is everything. But I got. I gotta let you know. Conscious. Is gonna feel some type of way. My my my. My my my. Ooh. Look at uh William face. He's like bitch, please. Bitch, please. He said, where, where she at? Bring her out. Okay, oh, period. I got something for that raggedy whore. Oh. Okay. We're not gonna, we're not gonna give no place to the devil. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> we're not. Okay. We're not. We're not gonna give any place to uh Man, you know what I enemy. just thought about, Will? We could do, we're, we can do, that's so much that we could talk about as relates to the Ooh, church oh my and some God, Larry. and the story because the ones you broke the ones that i'm credited with breaking but i never broke store you know and just have them discussion and everybody see what so you didn't make up them lies uh, on td jakes you didn't you didn't you didn't spread those rumors you, you wasn't the one breaking or br that story my, my, my. With Manasseh. Ain't nobody even know who Manasseh was. Until you got to saying that he was being groomed by T.D. Jakes. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. About it. it. Would be that would be dope. Incredible. Yeah, we need to plan that. Yeah. I, that's so much that we could talk about as relates to the church. Oh, my and some God, these, these Larry. Story, and these story because the ones you broke, the ones that I'm credited with breaking, but I never broke store. You know, and just have them discussion and everybody see what we think about it. it. Would be that would be dope. Incredible. Yeah, we need to. Yeah, this ain't the first yeah, time. I, he and I don't build a sound uh, uh, so we definitely can. Do that. Oh my God! Also, I can come over there and just cut oh, it up. Right. <laughs> you gonna go where? <laughs> oh, did you ask conscious? I could Don't come over to the sound stage and just show out. Yeah, all the way up. You better Absolutely. find your own and leave conscious man okay, so alone. I gotta go. But thank okay. you. Thank you Ooh. for critiquing. Conscious me calling that phone right now. I'm still, still gonna release go. it. Okay. <laughs> but thank you for critiquing and, and talking about it. It's coming out called You Ain't Talking About Nothing. You just yeah. That's it. We got to hear it. We got to hear it, and we're looking forward to it. Man, I am just elated that we have uh that we have reconnected. Yeah. Reunited. It's really easy. Absolutely. All right. See you later. Absolutely. Yes, right. sir. Bye-bye.
I thought y'all was over there sinking. What, what time did we hear them sing? When they were sinking, they was over there sinking. Reunited and it felt so good. <laughs> Reunited and the honor stood. Guys, uh, <laughs> he was over there sinking. They were sinking. What happened to the song? What's the time stamp on the song? I must have missed it. I was skipping through. It was getting long. These two is long with it. And uh, Facebook is acting weird right now. Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to everybody watching. We're in okay on period. Yes, uh, like this video. Like this video. Like this video. Win. Yes. <laughs> oh, so as I stated, you know, that sit down caused Conscious TV to break down, go live on Instagram crying. Uh, 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 you know, uh, and it's causing people to think that there must be some truth to what William said to have conscious TV cry. My, 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 for the girls that don't believe he was crying, okay. Ooh. And uh, ooh, we got the receipts, we got the receipts, okay. On period, we're working on acquiring the video. Uh, let me see if the video came in yet. Let me see if the video came in yet. We might not get to see it on this live. We might have to wait till the next live. Okay, on period. But there is a video. There is a video. There is a video. Ooh. My, my, my. My, my, my. So let's get into the sugar baby of it all. Okay, on period. The sugar of it all. Yes, it did. Um, Conscious TV. Oh, he's a legend that, you know, he's, he's been living that sugar baby lifestyle. And it's all because of Larry Dingleberry Reed when okay, on period. Um, in this live, he discusses their fallout and much, much more. Okay, he says that he does not want Larry back. He's not going back. If he goes back, it's going to be because Larry uh, 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 apologized in the right manner. Okay, they did this shit publicly. He wants a public apology. Okay, he don't want no gifts. He don't want no money. He wants you to correct what you did in the same manner that you did it. Yes, it did. On a public platform. Okay, on period. Shit. Shit. I know that's right. Thank you, Tata B. Yes. yes, you know, this was a three part show. Yes. Uh, continue to support. Okay, on period. So let's get into it. Let's get into it when I got the uh, time stamps. Okay, on period. Everything being shown to you guys during this video is being shown to you guys underneath the fair use and copyright doctrine. It's my motherfucking opinion. Make sure we see, take it out if you want to take it. Just don't be weird. Okay. Um, now, these girls have been talking in cold. All of them been talking in cold. But, you know, with uh, everything that I've shown you on tonight, okay, on period. Everything I've shown you on this morning, it's the morning time. I'm horrible with time, okay, on period. I just do what I do when I do it. Um, you, you. You you will know exactly what he's talking about. Um, it's something when it comes up, okay. Then mind you, this was done directly after that live. So even in the chat, the people in the chat knew what what was up. Okay, they know what was up. Okay, on period. These girls like to say everything, but the person's name. Okay, on period. But that's okay. It's okay. Leave it to the official king pain to bring some clarity. When okay, on period. Guys, uh, guys, uh, these girls they try, they try, the crown family be on it. Listen to this right now. I have some people who are trying to make up with me. Who there are some makeup sessions that are attempting to be had, and my, my issues with the makeup sessions are a, a few things for one. The people that are attempting to make up with me did really bad things. Ooh. What they did. And not even bad things as in like, you know, eons ago. But bad things as in like, girl, just 25 hours ago. Just like last year ago. Ooh. Just like a few months ago. Ooh. And 
Oh, now you want to speak out. You, you didn't have a problem when you were spending Larry money when Larry's paying your bills, but now you're remembering all the things that he's done to you. But if you forgave him for every other time that he did something or every time he showed his true colors and he didn't claim you, okay, when he's, what he's talking about a year ago is exactly one year ago is the, the whole falling out with Tasha K where Larry Reed would deny him publicly and say that he was just a fan. That's what happened a year ago. And then he less than 24 hours ago, Larry Reed would deny him pretty much again when uh, uh, William would allege that Conscious TV has HIV and Larry wouldn't say anything as if, you know, he doesn't know Conscious like that. He said, that's my friend, but you've been, you've been fucking Conscious. You know his status. If he has HIV, then, I mean, you would know it. And Conscious says that, you know, Larry is so adamant about defending his status that he's willing to throw me under the bus. Larry Reed is defending the truth for the lie. He said, truth is, he's the one that has HIV. Tell the truth. That's what he said. Listen to this. I'm all for people being different and people repenting and people becoming brand new but the issue with the people who are trying to make up with me is that they actually aren't different people and they don't want to publicly correct the things that they did publicly and i don't believe in resolving public matters privately if all hell broke loose publicly then all heaven is going to have to break loose publicly as well. My, 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 and that heaven, heaven reference is, is, is in reference to, uh, uh, you know, Larry being a man of God, allegedly. My, 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 like this video, like this video, like this video right now, like this video right now, man, girl, it's a lot of shit going on. And it's not enough to just, we wake up one day and we're okay because you just ready to be okay and I'm ready to be okay. No, bitch. I also am protecting my peace. And so it also matters to me who the fuck Ooh. is occupying my energy and who the fuck gets my energy and who the fuck Ooh. is connected to me. Like, like, just like who I am is important to me, who the fuck you are, are insignificant as well. Especially, you know, if we're talking about you being in my life. Now, you don't have to change for the better. And you don't got to atone for anything publicly if the plan is for you to just stay over there. Oh, my, my, my. So he said if Larry's planning on staying over there, if Larry don't want all, all of this back. Okay, Larry not worried about hitting this pussy again. When He don't got to say nothing. He can just stay over there. I don't give a fuck. I'm working on shit. Me and Claudia got some shit in the works. Okay, I'm working on uh, milking a new camel. Fuck Larry. But if Larry... Wants to get his good thing back, okay? If he need a, another clown to come and windmill for him, win, okay, on period, to come and, and, and rub on his saggy balls, okay, on period, then he better fix this shit. He better fix this shit because I don't need people to think that I got HIV, okay, on period. If you're going to tell it, told the truth, we got HIV. That's what it was. He's so adamant about protecting his image that he he's willing to throw and sacrifice anybody away. Let's talk about it. That's what God just said. These his words, not mine. I got the receipts. Listen to this. And me say over here. But the problem with wanting to make up and wanting there to be some, some forward moving that involves the both of us together is, once again, people don't want to correct the shit that they're going to need to, that they're going to have to fucking correct mm -hmm. if they want access to any degree of me. Mm -hmm. He said, you're going to have to correct this shit if you want to access to any degree of me win, okay, up here. If you want to hit this pussy again, if you want to ride this pony ride win, you're going to have to correct this motherfucking shit. You're going to have to make it right. And that's just on period. That's what he said. Listen to this. And these people also haven't changed. Ooh. Larry ain't changed. Why? And for me. Ooh. He ain't changed for you. He ain't changed for you. What he supposed to be doing? What he supposed to be doing? Let the girls know in the back what he's supposed to do. Is your bills not paid on time? 
See, that's why Larry be so, so fucked up, because Larry be doing everything for these motherfuckers, and they still find some reason to motherfucking turn on him. That's why Larry be fucked up and bothered by behind this shit when. That's why Larry over there stressed and losing motherfucking weight when these motherfuckers keep on finding new ways to siphon his motherfucking money. The Lord's money. He know he ain't supposed to be spending that on pussy. Okay? Let's talk about it. Spending the Lord's money on pussy. My attitude is, I I'm not going to... speak truth to power and be a check and balance system Ooh. for the fuck shit in the world and then not put that fuck shit through the proper fil filters if that fuck shit is talking about coming back into alignment with myself because I feel like to disregard the repentance of it all to, to disregard you know the who this, these people are is to also kind of shit on my own mission. Mm. So I, I. So he said to disregard who you know Larry is sitting with, to disregard William McCray is kind of shitting on his own mission, the mission that Larry sent him on, the mission to get William by any means necessary. And it worked. You know, to this day, William has not recovered from all of the chaos and, and the the. the people that Larry sent after him let's talk about it now Larry is rekindled things with William and he wants conscious to come and make things right as well conscious is like bitch I'm what I look like bitch after you to have me like what are you why are you even there let's start there why are you over there can't just make up so we can't just make up I can't because he can't make up why i was on a mission and it was Ooh. a justified mission Ooh. and he said he was on a mission and it was justified he said it was fighting for my man my man my man my man okay on period it's unfortunate your man is a fucking idiot and got you out here looking just as dumb huh fucking clown ass one of my missions as an avenger is to Ooh, not an avenger protect the innocent and a lot of people trusted in me and they relied on me Ooh. And I showed up for them. Ooh. And I'm not going to let them down or slap them in the face or gaslight them by aligning with their abuser when that abuse Ooh. was the truth. And if that, and if those people are not going to vindicate the people that they've hurt and vindicate my mission <laughs> by addressing and being able to own up to the fuckery of it all, then no. He said, if Larry not able to address it and own up to it, then no. Fuck it. Fuck it. He, he don't want to be in the conservatorship no more. He done with Larry. That's what he said. Yeah, so he said, that's my man, and I will stand beside him as long as he's standing beside me. Yes, he did. Kingpain, I'm noticing William's face is consistently breaking out under his nose. He always getting pimples in that particular area. Someone in the chat on his recent live on Facebook, pointed that out. I tried to tell you when. Hold my mule. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, my, my, my. Rewind that. Rewind that. Okay, I'll send it back a little bit. Took about a minute back. And, and a lot of people trusted in me. And they relied on me. And I showed up for them. That's what he said, friend. And I'm not going to let them down or slap them in the face or gaslight them by aligning with their abuser when that abuse was the truth. Mm. And if that, and if those people are not going to vindicate the people that they've hurt and vindicate my mission <laughs> by addressing and being able to own up to the fuckery of it all, then no. And, and pretty much he's feeling, you know, like, how dare you? How could you? You know, you had me beefing with this guy. You had me doing all of these things. And now you you guys want to play buddy-buddy. You guys want to pretend like you guys are friends. And, you know, Conscious is pretty much saying that he don't want to be fake. He don't want to be fake with him. That's some fake-ass shit that you're doing. It's fake. Fuck all you fake-ass bitches. I got some shit working. I got some shit in the work with Claudia Jordan. I don't need you no more. Kiri, you ain't been coming over my show like you used to anyway.
Listen, Linda, listen, Linda. And there's much more. Um, he goes on to say, I ain't going to be um, making up. He said, ain't going to be no making up. Okay. Larry Reed is over there trying to defend himself against the truth. Um, again, pretty much confirming that Larry has HIV. Listen to this. I said, girl, he's not playing with Larry. He's not playing with Larry either. We ain't okay on period. Larry got what? Listen yeah, to this. Well, like, mm -mm. ain't gonna be no making up, bitch. Like, because you know what you did. Y'all know what y'all did. And we're not about to have no sisterhood and have no brotherhood and be on no kiki nothing. Because in holding your whack ass accountable, you try to then spin the block and pull a reverse fucking Uno to deflect off yourself. Ooh. Instead of just taking the fucking opportunity to really do some self-correction. But instead, you decided to defend yourself against what the fuck was actually true. My, my, my. My, my, my. He said Larry was over there trying to defend himself against what was actually true. Larry was trying to defend himself against what was actually true. My, my, my. What are your thoughts? Let me know in the chat. Let me know in the chat. My, my, my. Like this video, like this video, like this video right now. Oh, what he said. One more time for the girls in the back. One more time for the girls in the back win. Okay, on period. Well, you know, Fish King Pain got all the receipts. You know, the Fish yeah, King Pain got like, the receipts. Mm -mm. Ain't gonna be no making up, bitch. Like, because Ooh. you know what you did. Y'all know what y'all did. Ooh. And y'all know what y'all did. You and oh, 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 oh. William, y'all know what y'all did. Like people said in the chat, they feel like it was rehearsed. He knew what William was already going to say, uh, 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 you know, um, and, and, and Larry did nothing. Larry did not defend um, Conscious. Like, you know, Conscious has defended Larry so many times in the past. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Peyton. Shout out to Peyton. Shout out to everybody donating. Yes, donate. We just passed the four-hour threshold. We just passed the four-hour threshold. Keep us here longer. Keep us here longer. Okay, I'm here. At this time, we're going to ask everybody to just send $4. Send $4. Okay, I'm here. Every hour, we are here. Just start sending oh, 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 the monies. Okay, just start sending the monies. Keep the show going. Keep the show going. Win. Okay, I'm here. We've been here four hours. Let's send $4. Period. Let's go. We not about to have no sisterhood and have no brotherhood and be on no kiki nothing because in holding Bad your whack ass Bad. accountable you try to then spin the block and pull a reverse fucking uno to deflect off yourself instead of who said larry tried to pull a reverse fucking uno to try to reflect off his motherfucking self he tried to pull a reverse fucking uno to try to deflect off himself he said larry trying to deflect Instead of defend his base honor, instead of defending conscious TV and his pussy, Larry was deflecting because he don't want nobody to think that he has HIV. That's what he said. In, in conscious TV, he said, it's true. He does. Listen to this. Instead of just taking the fucking opportunity to really do some self-correction, but instead you decided to defend yourself against what the fuck was actually true. And cause harm to those who you fucked over and those who were protecting those who you fucked over. My, my, my. So he said you decided to defend yourself against what was actually true. What was Larry Reed and William McRae discussing? What was Larry Reed over there defending himself against? Years of what? Since 2019, he's been getting accused of what? What was the conversation about? Do, does anybody need me to remind? them what the conversation was about do i need to go back and pull it up do i need to go back and pull it up does anybody remember what larry and and, and william mccray was talking about the package 
He was defending himself against the Packets, against being gay, against having HIV. He said people have been saying that he has this disease for a year since 2019. And Williams said, oh, well, your friend conscious definitely has it. Larry said, well, I don't want to talk about that. I can't talk about that. But uh, I definitely don't got it. Pretty much that's what he said. Pretty much that's what he said. That's what I heard, what y'all heard. That's what Conscious heard, what y'all heard. Larry pretty much said that Conscious got it, I don't got it. That's the just of what was what happened. William said Conscious got it, Larry said he don't. But they're both friends. You I mean, we always see Conscious defending Larry. Why? Does Larry refuse to defend conscience or even claim conscience? He you now publicly he don't want people to know he even knows conscience. Oh, he's such a loser. <laughs> Girl. And what the fuck it looked like with us just showing up in a space together in good energy and that posture and that crime and the bluff from those crimes have not been atoned for. Ooh. At this point, I just love myself too much and take my own work seriously enough to maintain the continuity. I'm okay with evil, the evil villains of Gotham converting into the heroes of the city. As long as, once again, that's under the guise of actual change and transformation. But you still just want to pretend to be a good guy. Or you want to just have access to me and be on your bald headed hoe shit. No. Mm -mm. I'm not working this hard and I have personally sacrificed too much. And once again, I've given too much of my energy and too much of my time to just. Let. Cause here's the thing for me. What? He given too much of his energy and too much of his time to just what? To just what? Oh, y'all make sure that y'all supporting this video. We've been here four hours. We've been here four hours. Hop out of the bushes and send four dollars. Keep the show going. Keep the show going with it. Girl, to just what? To just what? Continue to bend over. Continue to grab your ankles. Continue to get that bussy blown out. Okay, on period. You're not giving up the bussy no more because Larry let people think that you got the, the clap. Okay, maybe he didn't want nobody else to uh, 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 come and hit it from the back. Okay, what, what what's the problem? Y'all over there, motherfucking, uh, 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 trying to build your immune system up. Okay, on period. <laughs> okay, Larry said, I am not me. Okay. Yeah, suddenly, all of a sudden, Larry evil. Now, Larry demonic. Now, he a frail, old, demonic, sick bitch, according to Conscious. Now, because Larry didn't let Conscious get thrown up under the bus. Listen to this. I can't deal with a pseudo positive outcome. Ooh. As you guys have already learned through this commentary, girl. It's like everything needs to be genuine. <laughs> everything needs to be on a theme. Every yeah, everything needs to be genuine. Everything needs to be on theme. Okay, on period. So, um, you know, he basically is saying that, you know, him and Larry needs to be on the same page. He, you know, if he's going to be out here defending Larry, if they're going to be in a relationship, okay, it needs to be, it needs to go both ways. It needs to be, uh, it needs to go both ways. Y'all like this video, like this video, win. Remember to support, we're asking everybody to send $4 for the four hours we've been here. Let's go. In the way that it needs to be done. And, um, you guys will see everything play out. How it needs to play out. And what I can tell you guys is not going to happen is I'm not going to go. I, I'm not going back to Ooh. unchanged people. Oh, he said he ain't going back. If Larry don't change, he's not going back. He said he don't know what's going to happen. What, but he can tell you that he's not going back to unchanged people. If Larry don't make a change, that uh, 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 you know, things are changing. Get used to it, okay? Get used to not seeing Larry on CTV platform. Um, and you know, this don't have to be messy unless he wanted to. 
So, I mean, he can go his way and I can go mine, period. But if he wants us to work things out, then he's going to have to apologize in public. Like he, like they told that lie. Yeah, friend. Can somebody help Sharon with the PayPal link? Sharon would like the PayPal link. Thank you, real. I know that's right. I don't care if those unchanged people still love me. Oh, I don't care if those unchanged people still so, have a value for me. Not. I don't care about none of that. If they have not changed for the better, Ooh. I don't care uh, about what they want. There will not be a us without the change. Oh, he said there will not be an us without the change. There will not be an us without the change. Let Larry grow some balls somewhere, okay? Let Larry grow some motherfucking guts, okay? And he start protecting me like my man should. Then he ain't gonna. I ain't, I ain't gonna have no men. Period. Men where? Men where? Larry gonna be mad when I'm giving this bussy away from free. He gonna be mad when I'm giving this bussy away from free for free. Okay, on period. Had him paying for a win. Okay, on period. The next nigga you get with definitely gonna is definitely gonna be for the for the free. My 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 like this video, like this video, like this video right now. It's up and it's stuck in the home of the situation. Let's go. That needs to accommodate that as well. One of my baby mothers. Hold on, somebody. Thank you, Courtney, for the dance piece of cash app. Thank you, baby mama. Thank you. Who oh, appreciate the serious truth sayer in you. Thank you. <laughs> AG baby. You know, um, because y'all, I've been through some shit. And I have put, I mean, I have really had to do not only my motherfucking work, bitch, I've had to do, I mean, I have had to show up. Ooh. I've had to show up for people. In real Ooh. ways, in sacrificial ways. In so he's saying that he had to make sacrifices for Larry. He's not to show up for Larry. He's, you know, had to carry Larry when he knew Larry was wrong. And, you know, he expects the same in return, period. Ways that really costed me. I mean, who could blame and him? I don't blame him for I feeling like this. In I just blame him for being a stupid hoe for all the, 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 this, this, this fucking long. And, you know, I don't, you know, he fucked up his platform. He really fucked up his platform fucking with Larry. He not even monetized over there. Like Larry cut him off. He's like he over here talking about going to school and getting a job, all kind of shit. I'm trying to told you, like he, he fucked up and bothered without Larry. Mm -hmm. In that, I love, I, I I love it for me, and it's not enough for a bitch to just think they can just pull up on me and and Ooh. and give me a little one two one two and think that it's all good because it ain't bitch. Oh, he said, you can't just pull up on me and give me a little one, two, one, two, thinking it's all good because it ain't bitch. Calling Larry Reed a bitch. <laughs> Go off, conscious. Yes, he did. Oh, shit. <laughs> he said, you think you're good, but it ain't bitch. That shit that you pulled over there with motherfucking uh, uh, William McCray, you think that shit good? You think it was good? Well, it ain't bitch. And I can show you better than I can tell you. My, 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 my. He goes on to say that Larry has no authority over me. Larry has no power over me. Larry has no control over me. I, I, the fuck? The fuck? The fuck? Larry better get it together or forget it forever. Okay, on pair, because he about to lose all this good pussy. That's what it, listen, 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 Linda, listen. Bitch, I'm standing on business, bitch. I'm here to stand on business. I came to stand on business. I don't want to look like my fucking enemies that's why i can't even fight these hoes the way that they fight bitch you know we don't dox we don't do any of that shit over here like, I, don't, I, I don't i don't even employ the same energy and the same weapons um can and could because it ain't it it, it ain't no authority Ooh. governing me this is all self-governance this is no larry ain't your daddy no more this is all self self-afflicted virtue self-afflicted virtual so you knew what you was getting yourself into when you got into it so nobody should feel sorry for you tell the truth tell the truth you know i'm not in that space i don't want to i can't just be with anybody i can't just sit with just anybody i can't just work with just anybody like i'm just in that place Ooh. where you know in the worst and i guess william mccray is just anybody my my man even though larry said he was a blueprint and daryl moore said that he had three hundred thousand followers back in the day before larry took his platform down you know country tv has only he hasn't even 
reached 50,000 subscribers like you're not even on 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 the level in the lane or you know you, you don't even haven't even been able to taste it so my 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 I think Larry is uh, 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 thinking about uh new 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 business ventures I think that's you know I think he's thinking about going in a different direction Erica Badu who I'm gonna drag later <laughs> you know this is my art and I'm sensitive about my shit and I finally period accept that that's who I am and I'm happy and I'm content and I'm at peace with being a bitch who takes his shit seriously um my, my, my. My, my. so he said the Larry ain't got no authority over him <laughs> he said I don't know what you heard about me but Larry ain't got no power over here. <laughs> yeah, Larry ain't got no power over here. Okay. Oh. So then he goes on to say, Larry needs to apologize publicly. Larry's a demonic, frail weirdo. And they did that shit in public. So he needs to apologize in public. Let's talk about it. And whatever, whatever, whatever. Because I've already told them, like, you're going to have to come with it publicly. You're going to have to atone publicly. Because that's where the transgressions and the offenses took place. Ooh. And for two, it's not enough that you just want to be good and you just want things to be fluff between oh. us, bitch. If you're still a raggedy, decrepit, demonic, broken, frail, weirdo, then stay the fuck away from me, bitch, because I also don't need your isolated ass positivity either. <laughs> Did y'all hear that shit? My, 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 like this video, like this video, like this video right now. Oh, my goodness, it's up and it's stuck here in the home of the situation. Girl, Conscious done had it, girl. Conscious done had it. He's calling Larry out on all of his shit. They said, ah, this. Because I'm not co-signing. No fuck shit. Oh, you're not no co-signing no you more. you flip out again and you turn into a Hurricane Katrina again and you want to be a tsunami again or win all your bullshit, you know, hit the fan again, bitch. Like, I'm going to need. And he not co-signing shit no more. Yeah, now he demonic, and now he's not co-signing shit no more. Yeah. Yeah, that's what he said when. This is words, not mine. This is words, not, not mine. Now Larry is demonic, and he not co-signing no more. Larry lies no more, period. Pretty much, you know, saying that he lied. He was lying for Larry. Pretty much, that's what that means. Okay, which please? Yes, it did. Which please? Yay. Yeah, so like this video, support this video. We asked everybody send $4 for the four hours we've been live. Pop out of the bushes and support. Let's go no relations and dealings don't want none of the residual impact don't want none of the residual faults don't want none of that bitch like you gonna have to give what i give <laughs> in vibration my 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 he said i don't want none of that you gonna have to give what i give okay pre pretty much saying that it's my way or the highway my 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 we got we know we just gotta uh no tune in to figure out what had happened when what had happened when okay on period he goes on to state that he don't want to see any more fucked up people in power um a legend that you know larry's a fucked up person he's a fucked up person and he don't want to see no more fucked up people like larry in power he says i'm sick of it i'm over it contribution is so i don't want to see any more fucked up ass people Thank you, Without, Karen. I don't want to see no more fucked up ass people with influence. I don't want to see no more fucked up ass motherfucker. I'm, I'm sick of it. I'm not. Over it. And I ain't got nothing to do with other people pedestalizing all the wrong people. The only thing I can do is make sure that I don't contribute to the pedestalization and the liberation of all the wrong motherfuckers. So that's that. What's going on, brains? Tickle. CTV made me change my profile picture to my war face. <laughs> what's going on, Sharon? Hey, y'all, what's going on? Brandy on the rocks. Um, with that being said, let's move into some sugar baby teas. <laughs> so we're going to go into a completely different left situation, girl. Okay. <laughs> um, this sugar baby lifestyle is very fascinating to me. Um, you guys know that I think in my last live stream, I had. My, my, my. My, my, my. 
So now he's going to discuss his sugar baby lifestyle um, with Larry Reed. My, my, my. My, my, my. Hop out of the bushes, like this video, like this video, like this video. Pretty much confirming that, you know, the relationship between him and Larry was a, a sugar daddy, sugar baby relationship. Pretty much. Listen to this. Listen to this. has been a very interesting ride as a sugar baby okay I... he said it has been a very interesting ride as a sugar baby ma, ma, ma. now when i say sugar baby there are definitely definitely various tier groups <laughs> to be a sugar baby okay you have sugar babies who do like non-sexual sugar baby work okay and then you got sugar babies who be like on the escort and shit. You know, all sugar babies are not made equal, bitch, okay? Um, but I think what I'm understanding, because I have homegirls and homeboys who are a part of the sugar baby culture and the sugar baby world, and the principle at work is using what you got to get what the fuck you want. And I did not know that there are people in this world who look for convenience and who will pay you to accommodate them that is a very like interesting world like and people will are willing to pay you for what is considered to be mundane interactions um you got sugar daddies and sugar mamas that you only text that you only you know are on facetime with that you may even see in person and they are willing to monetize your time and just monetize your company. They're willing to monetize flirt, like flirtiness and flirtatiousness and the amounts of guap that people are willing to spend just for your time or just to play into a fantasy. It has been very extreme to actually, you know, like to hear about these things is one thing, but then to like be brought into the culture itself has been very eye-opening it has taught me a lot about the wealthy. <laughs> it's taught me a lot about the lifestyles of the wealthy um, and how time is, is something that a lot of wealthy people are, that they don't have a, a lot of, which is why they have a kind of like a drive-through attitude, like a, you know, because what they really are paying for, whether it's your time, it's your friendship, it's your whatever it is, they're paying for convenience. They're paying to have you right there, right here at this time in this way, emotionally, mentally, physically, et cetera, whatever way, whatever the arrangements are. Because once again, various tier groups, girl, to the sugar baby shit, okay? I got friends who... My, my, my. We ain't talking about your friends. We're not worried about your friends. What's going on with you and Larry? What's going on with you and Larry Reed? You guys remember to support the show. Hop out of the bushes and support the Fish King Pain. Oh, oh, it's working hard today, when okay, on period. We got two more shows planned today, okay, on period. So make sure these guys are supporting, okay, on period. I want you guys to know I appreciate all of you. We can't do it without your support, okay, on period. Hop out of the bushes, support, support, support. It's up and it's stuck here in the home of the situation. Um, Kaza TV he goes on to uh, pretty much say that, you know, um, it's been a good ride. Uh, you know, he enjoyed being a sugar baby. Unfortunately, things have come to an end and he's planning on working and going back to school. Listen to this. A fucking bitches who just so annoying, up, friend. work so out, annoying. vegan, plant-based, you know, they stay in the gym. They're fit because their equity is in their health and it's in their beauty. And they literally just have their lifestyles completely afforded to them just because. Mm. Of what they look like and all uh, what they are offering to their clientele and are not even having to once again even pop no pussy in order to do that. Man. And I love it. I love it for them. I love it for us. <laughs> oh, he love it for us. My, my, my. I mean, if that's not confirmation for you girls, my, my, my. So I say all that to say, girl, time to change in. Mm. And don't be afraid, girl. You know, it's just, it's just, um, you guys heard the old saying that like, 
the person who was drowning kept asking spirit to like come rescue them come rescue them come rescue them and so spirit sent them a boat they was like no sent them a helicopter no sent them you know sent them help for every no 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 because they needed spirit to come and to literally pull them and rescue them up girl and then they end up drowning girl okay girl where a lot of these things that are being introduced to the culture um girl these are the boats and the helicopters coming to the motherfucking aid bitch and uh I would just encourage folks to get real open-minded because the system, it don't give a fuck about you. And if you allow it to take away the quality of your life, if you allow it to take to take you away from your children, take you away from your dreams, take you away from yourself, take you away from whatever the fuck, it, it will. Because it's it's all about self. The system is all about self. My, my, my. My, my, my. I, and I guess Larry Reed is the system that you, you've, you've gotten used to. Okay, on period. Now that system is not working for you and you feel some type of way you feel some type of way uh, you know larry is not under your control any long any longer you know uh, 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 it seems as though he's he's reconnected with william and you know he don't need you no more my 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 not trying just being tossed to the side like a piece of trash him speaking out this is not the first time he spoke out either you know you know when Lester came forward, he posted receipts, uh, you know, text messages between him and Larry, where Larry was alleging that he wanted to fuck conscious in the ass. You know, and then when Vincent came forward, conscious posted the receipt of Larry confirming to him that he did have a sexual relationship with Vincent. So this is I've already seen this coming. I've seen this coming. I've been calling it for a minute. It's going to get worse because you guys all know. That conscious knows a lot more about Larry than he's putting on. Okay, he's been a part of covering, covering up so many lies and narratives for Larry that when he's fed up, you know, the truth will finally come out. Yes, it did. Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to everybody watching. It's been an amazing show. Okay, on period, we made it through all three segments. I'm excited. I'm happy. You know, this is what I wanted. Okay, on period. I, I, I like to, you know, when I when I work hard on my content, I like to at least uh, present it. You know what I'm saying? So thank you guys for allowing me to present my concert, my content to you guys. I said concert. Okay, I'm period. It's like a concert. We've been here long enough. Uh, um, we'll be back later. You know, later on on this channel, we're going to be talking about uh, Mahogany Jackson. We have updates. We have updates. And then on the backup channel, uh, we, we, we have updates about uh, Jacket. Okay, on period, Jackie over there lying and acting like I, I'm calling her phone. I'm not calling her phone. When I'm not calling her phone, I don't even have her number. I thought she changed her number. How can I be calling her phone if she changed her number? Like, make it make sense. Anyway, we'll talk about it on the backup channel. You guys, make sure that you guys are subscribed to the backup channel. I've seen people asking for the links to the backup channel. Here, let me give you the link to the backup channel. And there's two backup channels so that you guys know. We have our Crown Family backup channel. And we have the Lituation Network TV backup channel. Okay, for, so when you guys are looking for backup channels, just know that we have two. We have a Crown Family channel now that we're going to start frequenting. Um, and I want you guys all to subscribe to the Crown Family um, YouTube channel right here on YouTube. Okay, on period. It's going up. It's going up. We're trying to get it monetized um, for my people. Okay, on period. Yeah, so uh, we're trying to get a monetized for my people's wins. Yes, it did. And then we have the Lituation Network. Okay, on period. Let me give you the link for that. Okay, I like to put the links in the chat before I head out. Okay, up here. My stomach hurt. I gotta go eat and I got some hair clients coming. Like, girl, I got a lot of shit to do today. Oh, I'm trying to just keep my energy right. Keep my energy right. Okay, on period. So I can get back to work. Crown family be missing me. Yes, it did. Oh, I love you all. You guys have been amazing. Thank you for all the support. Shout out to everybody that supported. Um, I, I've been shouting people out throughout the live. So hopefully I got to you. If I didn't get to you, I just want to say I, I appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. You guys are all amazing. Thank you guys for supporting my content. Thank you guys for supporting me. Thank you guys for supporting the platform. Make sure that you guys are subscribed on the way out because YouTube be hating on me when. I love you all with the love of Jesus. It's been amazing. You guys have been amazing when okay on period. Girl, I have fun. I have fun when okay on period. Oh, until next time, I'm headed out. 
Until next time, I had it out. I love you all. Adios. I got to get ready for the next show. I'll see you guys all on the Lituation Network next. Okay, on period. We got some. We we on Jackie neck. We on Jackie's neck. Okay, on period. And then later on tonight, we're going to talk about mahogany on this channel right here. So come on in. Come on in. Make sure you just, that you're subscribed with all your notifications turned on. It's the official King Pain show. I love you all with the love of Jesus. Until next time. Thanks for watching and adios. <laughs>